All right, everybody. It is time. It's time to play some more Witcher 3. <laughs> so I'm kind of at a space right now with the with the channel where we could play just about anything because, uh, you know, I mostly do survival building games, but but I have pretty much played out uh, most of the ones available. Um, waiting for some new ones to come out. There are some oldie but goodies that we could check out. Um, but I was kind of considering what to play right now. We already did uh, four months of Conan, and that's not over. Those servers are still up. But I kind of needed a break. We are in the monkey library. That's right. We have to uh, plan a little bit and <laughs> make our battle plan before we go in. Um, but uh, I am ready. Which was already actually open. Um, but yeah, they just released, CD Projekt Red uh, released a free upgrade to The Witcher 3 uh, about a month ago, actually. And they it's their next-gen upgrade. So they added ray tracing, they went through all the textures and the visuals and upgraded them all. The reason I delayed playing it, because uh, as you may know, I did a full Witcher playthrough before. Jay certainly knows. What's up, Pookie? What's up, Jay? What's up, everybody? Um, I did a full playthrough. I think we did 134 episodes of The Witcher and got through the whole main story. My Steam account shows I was approaching, uh, I think I was like 100 and a half hours, something like that, approaching 200. Uh, something, I think I had like 167 hours in The Witcher, maybe. <laughs> yeah. So um, anyway, we did the whole main story but I still have both DLCs to do. Um, so I definitely want to do those. But yeah, the reason I delayed jumping right into this is because the performance of the upgrade for The Witcher was uh, pretty heavy. It was like very stuttery, kind of headache inducing. They did do a hot fix that made it a lot better. And then on my end, I did a whole bunch of work to, uh, to make it work. So I figured out how to do this thing on my graphic card called, uh, I have a 3090, which should be able to handle it, no problem, but it struggles. Um, so I did this thing called resizable bar that basically allows it to gobble up more data uh, more easily. <laughs> yeah, we did a lot. Nam says she can't watch because she doesn't want spoils, has game, but hasn't played much of it yet. Well, she better jump in. She's got a hundred or two hours to go. <laughs> But tell her I'll miss her. I'll miss her. In fact, we're going to spoil a lot. We're going to spoil the ending at the beginning right now, which I'm going to explain in a second. But um, so I did that. I did a lot of tweaking with the settings. I've um, got it to where it kind of hangs right around 60. And then a mod came out about a week ago that um, makes the ray tracing uh, basically a little less heavy. Um, so. Basically, I used the mod to take it so we can get more of a stable 60 FPS. Um, and then I did another mod that also helps camera shake. <laughs> uh, and there's, I think there's one other mod I added also that helps with performance as well. So I got it to where we can just hold it at 60. If we go into a really busy town, it'll drop a little bit. But it feels playable to me. And, uh, you know, I almost jumped into uh, Divinity Original Sin 2 instead, but I like, you know, as far as RPG goes, that one may be technically better, but this one is just going to be more fun because <laughs> it, it just has so much flavor. The Witcher is so rich. The, 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 all the, uh, the quests and the side quests are just so well done, so well written, you know, um, that I thought we should come back to this and do it. So we'll see how far we get. Um, so, like I said, I was going to jump right into the DLCs now, but when we did the playthrough, we got the worst possible ending. <laughs> we, we got the worst possible ending, um, you know, so I'm going to go ahead. So if you don't want spoilers, you probably should leave now because um, I'm going to talk about the ending a little bit. Uh, but there's a series of dialogue choices that are kind of obtuse. It's really hard to know which ones they'd be. And I got the one where Siri dies at the end, uh, which was just devastating. You know, and at the end, he's back at the, the three crones hut uh, out there in the, in, the, in the swamp, and all the creatures are coming to get him. 
Now, of course, it doesn't really matter because when you finish the main story, it sets you back in time someplace vaguely before the end, and none of that actually happens. Um, but just for the sake of it, you know, I thought if we're going to go forward with the DLCs, uh, we'll never make it back to the Sandy. And I looked through my saves, and just at the very end of them is the one we need to go back to to, um, to get the better endings. <laughs> and the ankles are so deliciously glass-like. Now, that's one of the things. There's a lot of things they did also change with the update. Is apparently they have made his ankles stronger. So they, uh, they uh, basically worked on fall damage so that we should take a lot less of it. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see. If I can break my ankles, you know I will. Anyway, let's hop on over to the game with all that stuff explained. And uh, we'll jump on over here. Oop. And thank you, everybody, for joining me for this. Uh, I'm really excited about it. Uh, I've got a nostalgic place in me for this. Uh, so whether you're watching now live or you're watching later, very much appreciate it. So here we go. We got Geralt. Now, if we load here, I going all the way back here. Apparently, I finished my playthrough in December, no, October, 2020, October 19th, 2020, and we could start from there. Rain Hats, what's up, man? Stop by to wish you have a great time. Witcher 3, sadly, you're on New Game Plus and won't be doing these until I'm done, so we'll be avoiding spoilers. Okay. I'm actually not jumping straight into the DLCs right now. I am going to um, go back uh, a few saves and get the better ending first. And then we'll go on to the DLC. So I don't even know if we'll actually finish that uh, first part today. Um, but I got the worst ending at the end. So I can't sit with that. And this is my chance while I still have the save. Because if we go back here... Back to October 11th, instead of October 19th, I've got blood on the battlefield. And that's where I need to go to uh, ma start making the series of dialogue choices. Cool, yeah. New Game Plus, that sounds fun. Yeah, so again, if you don't want to know how to get to the, to the different endings, you should probably not watch this, or definitely not watch this, but I'm going to explain it now. Is basically there's three since I finished it all the way myself I know I'm cutting myself off here since I finished the whole game now I felt free to go back because there's no way I was gonna figure this out by trial and error and I was vindicated in that I did some research and the three uh, quests that we need to get the right dialogue choices on for Siri are blood on the battlefield um, the final preparations and battle preparations and I just have those there. So if I played further much more, I'd lose these. I do have them backed up on another computer. But I figure we might as well get the ending right. And so we're going to go all the way back to Blood on the Battlefield. Can't believe it's been since 2020. Yeah, so basically it's been uh, two years and a month, right? Or a couple months. Two years and... October, November, December, two years and two and a quarter years. Yeah. So it's been a while. So it's a good time to get back to it. And because they did the upgrade, there are a lot of people playing it right now. Um, so, yeah. So we're going to go all the way back here to Sunday, October 11th, 2020, <laughs> and go to Blood on the Battlefield. Apparently, I played pretty late that night. Look at that. We went till three in the morning <laughs> on the stream. <laughs> All right. Uh, I used to do these on Twitch, actually, and then cut them into pieces and put them on YouTube. So you can go back and watch all 134 episodes. So technically, this would be episode 135. I didn't call it that because otherwise nobody would join. They'd be like, ah, 135? I'm way behind. All right, so let's go there. You got that ending the first time I played and was in a two-month depression. So... It all hinges on trying to be the best dad for Siri, right? But apparently the choices I would make to be the best dad 
are not the choices that uh, CD Projekt Red thought was <laughs> the best. Anyway, I did some research. So we are starting here at actually a very sad point. Um, the Battle of Kaer Morin has just happened. We fought the Wild Hunt. Uh, we were overwhelmed by them. Vesemir on the pyre there died. So Uncle Vesey, rest in peace. Pour one out for him. It was very sad. I'm not as thunderstruck now because uh, that was two years ago. <laughs> but oh, um, but then just when we thought all was lost, Siri uh, activated her power and she did this giant blast and and managed to to kill or get the uh, the wild hunt to flee. So we managed to drive or Siri managed to drive them away, and now we are saying goodbye to Vesemir at this. So we're going to go from here. So you can see the, um, it's looking pretty good. The, we are at all ultra plus settings at the moment. My little steam thing that show, should show, uh, the, um, frame rate is not showing, which I guess will keep me from worrying about it. Um, but yeah, just to show you guys real quick, um, here in the options, uh, the video and uh, the uh, graphics. So I basically set it on uh, ray tracing ultra. Um, so I've got all the ray tracing on, got DLSS on balanced, which is uh, also helping a lot. Um, and then I turned off my usuals. I turned off motion blur, blur, bloom, depth of field and chromatic operation. Vignetting you have to leave on apparently to get the photo mode and there's a photo mode now. Oh my god And I left on some uh, god rays here. I turned off camera lens effect So I you do I did need to turn off Nvidia hair works Because um, it has a huge toll and the way that they did this they went from DX 11 to DX 12 um, they did a bad port to DX12, and so a lot of performance is sucked up by that. So I turned this off, but I looked at it, and the difference is basically with the animals. Uh, with Hairworks on, the animals get poofy. <laughs> and with it off, they look kind of normal. So we'll sacrifice Hairworks for ray tracing, basically. And then you get all these settings here, um, and most of these are at Ultra Plus. Uh, they go from low to Ultra Plus, Number of background characters is how many NPCs you get in towns. That seems to have a really high effect and makes you CPU bound. So I turned that down to high from Ultra Plus. And shadows you always have a, take a toll on performance. And it's hard to tell the difference between the Ultra Plus and high. So I took those down. But terrain, water are both at Ultra Plus. Foliage, uh, I turned down a little bit because that's very expensive. And grass density is very expensive too, but it's still going to look great. So at the high, and then textures are at Ultra Plus, and detail levels are at Ultra Plus. So just so you know, that's what I did. And that was also in um, combination with uh, adding some, some mods uh, to it, which I'll show you real quick the mods I'm running. And then we'll jump in and we'll do all the uh, gameplay. So let me just find the folder for it over here in, uh, no, it's, uh, where is it? It's on my G drive. There we go. Boop, boop, boop. We'll go over to it. I just got to go into the game. I think it's on the game, on G drive. Steam. Common. Uh, no, actually, sorry. One second. It's on my other, I have like four drives for games. <laughs> four SS, SS, SSDs. Um, common. Ah, oh, where did I put it? All right, wait a minute. Uh, sorry. I should probably just tell you, but I got, I'm going to, in full transparency, I want to show you. All the mods I'm running here. Ah. All right, let me open Steam. <laughs> It'll take me there. I swear to God, I knew where it was. 
here it is. We'll just do the Witcher. We'll go to properties and uh, local files browse. There we go. Okay. So in uh, you can best place to see this is my mod downloads here. So basically, f to make the ray tracing work right. Hey, ladybugs, what's up? Less floof for more FPS. Yes. In your defense, Ray Matt, I feel the bad ending is just Siri in ice like Captain America. I refuse to believe she dies, right? And you actually, at the ending, you go back before that event anyway. Um, but I just want to get it right because I got to feel good about it. So the main one here is there's this mod, uh, Optimize uh, RTGI, Optimized Ray Tracing, basically. And all these you can get off Nexus mods. You can do quality or you can do performance. I'm running quality. And this basically makes the ray tracing implementation a little less heavy and gives you, uh, each one of these gives you a notch more FPS. So I'm running the quality one, which gave me about 10 more FPS, which manages to keep me at right about 60, which is cool. Um, and I also did the smooth camera motion one, because when you run, which you're running all the time, the camera shakes a bit. And that's just sort of natural in the game. But we wanted as less judderiness, as less... You know, there's a whole stutter struggle with the upgrade. So we did that. Um, and then other than that, I've just got some uh, quality of life thing. Oh, there's also this one here. This is the one I was trying to think of. Next gen movement input lag fix. With the update, whenever you moved, he'd pause for a second and then move. Whenever you, you know, you held still for a second, which was just kind of maddening. But someone uh, made a mod to fix that. Thank you, mods. So these three mods um, are basically what's allowing me to get to the quality to be able to play this. And then I just have a few more where basically you can hold the torch and fight uh, better torches. Because um, if you're in a dark in a cave, that would help a lot. Uh, one where if you're in the alchemy menu, menu uh, you can buy stuff from your recipes rather than having to look at the recipes and then go back to their stock. So no big deal. Oh yeah, and this is actually the fourth one to improve performance. This one improves the DLSS to the latest, um, the latest version of it, which is the game uses like 2.4, but DLSS is actually up to 2.51. So we're using the latest version of DLSS. And then these two just fix names on the characters. It gives them more specific names rather than like Nilfgaard officer, it'll say the name of the officer. And this one fixes grammar in the bestiary and adds more entries to it um, that have been, were deleted for some reason. So nothing that changes, uh, you know, my power in the game or anything like that. And then uh, that's about it. Oh yeah, Skippy Skippy just skips the, um, the, the cinematics in the intro and the things that warn you about flashing lights and stuff. I just go straight into the game and then wait um, I took off weight on, um, on runes, quest items, and dies. That's it. Everything else still weighs what it is. But it just takes a little edge off the weight with stuff that you're not going to throw out and you're going to need to carry all the time anyway. Yeah, so I got all those installed. Um, so just so you know, uh, that's what I did and how I got it working. So enough of that. Let's go play the game. All right. So, yeah, we got a ways to go. We probably have a few hours to get back to the ending again. Um, so let's go ahead and play. So we're at here. We can kind of talk to everybody. What's on your mind? Kaer Morin. Can't imagine this place without Vesemir. I'll head down the valley soon and find somewhere else to winter next year. Come on, it's the only home we've ever had. Stay. No, Geralt. Place has been dying a while. Last nail in the coffin today. Time we accepted that. All right, Geralt. Oh, excuse me, Eskel. <laughs> so this part is sad, but it looks good. It looks good. Thank you. 
please. She was my ward, too. And the old should only ever stick around to help the young. You know, this hardly ends your struggle. I know. Whatever you aim to do now, remember you'll find souls willing to aid you in Skellige. Myself, Krach, his children. Thanks. I'll remember that. I shall take another look at the wounded. But I'll need to go soon. I'll leave you some medicines. Go in hell, Thermion. Till we meet again. So, let me know if the volume's good, guys. Letho. You know, I just watched the history of... Uh, the story of 1 and 2. And I didn't realize Letho had such a deep... Uh, and mixed contribution to those. <laughs> he was actually the bad guy in some of it, for sure. Uh, there was a bunch of stuff he did. I could have killed him back in those, but I never played one and two. That was tough. We managed. Thanks for helping. You're welcome. Let's ask what he's going to do. What will you do now? Probably head east, cross the mountains. After that, we'll see. Farewell. And welcome in, ladybugs. How you doing? Volume's good for you, Pookie? Excellent. So, tell me. I can say I've seen it all now. I still don't believe everything that happened. Vernon Roach had a big part, too, in... Uh... I think at least in Witcher 2, um, if not Witcher 1. Risked your lives for me. How can I repay you? We love we'll us some character something. growth, yes. Right? A good arc. Definitely. We're there for a good arc. What will you do? We're bound for Novigrad. To fight the next fight. Yo, Bayman. If you miss us, What's look up? for us at the camp. I'm sure we'll see them again. Talk to the... Yeah, okay. So that was both of them. Lambert. How are you feeling? Please. Thanks for everything. Sure. Something wrong? <laughs> That's a dumb question. <laughs> Vesemir's dead. Get your health back. Leave me alone. Maybe I should have asked if something is wrong. Can we talk? What about? Holding up all right. Love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is oh my shit, goodness. Geralt, and you know it. I knew the old man couldn't live forever. Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death, whereas he died like a louse, crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me. You're waiting on Hogwarts, Bateman? You know, I'm going to play it. Uh, I was a little mixed whether I was or not, but uh, it was gifted to me, um, so I have it. And uh, definitely going to check it out. Um, we'll see. I'm not super psyched for it, but I definitely want to just take a peek. Um and that's not till February 10th, so definitely doing some other things to uh, fill the gap. Not that that really is the gap, but yeah. Um, all right. I think that's it. Let's just say see you. See you later. Yeah, take care. Okay. And Hjalmar on Krite. There you are. Crying shame about Vesemir. I'm sorry. Thanks for your help. I had a debt to pay. Heading straight back to Skellige? Wouldn't be right to tarry. War with the Black Ones won't wait. You can count on me, you know. Always. I know. Thanks. I know. My favorite guy, Zoltan. Come to see how I'm feeling. Thanks. 
Not bad. That's good. Not bad is good. Son, horrible about Vesemir. I know you were close. Thanks. We were. Listen, far be it from me to stick my beard for it'll no scratch an itch. So don't take this the wrong way. I want to help, whatever you decide, but to my mind, we've got to counterattack. We've got to find the hunt, Eredin, and charge at them both like a bull at a heifer. <laughs> Not that simple, unfortunately. We have no way of finding them. They find us easily. Can take us by surprise whenever they want. What's up, Warlord? Forgive me, Welcome Geralt, in. but that's the blathering of a man who clearly can't snap out of it after a tragic loss. Drink it off. Sleep it off. Whatever it takes. Just get yourself together and think things through. I'll do that, Sultan. Okay. So, uh, for folks just coming in now, what we're doing is we're coming back to the Witcher 3 after two and a quarter years um, to appreciate this upgrade that makes all these textures look so nice. Um, we, I was going to start on with the DLC, uh, but we're going back a, little, a few saves because I want to get the better ending. So if you don't want to get spoiled on the ending, uh, this will spoil it. Um, but yeah, before we move on, I want to do better basically for Siri and give her the best. We do have a choice we'll need to make. Um, what we think the best ending for her is, but I want her to at least live <laughs> at this point. One of the things they changed is they have a closer, a tighter camera Jirel angle. Jirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this some other time. One of the things I didn't like about The Witcher before was that you were so pulled out and he was so small. Uh, we are now way more closer over his shoulder. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. That's Avalach. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, he calls her Zirel. Everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch yeah. of magic. You mean the lodge? Many of the lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Fringilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best. Yeah, so we got to get the uh, Lodge of Sorcerers back together. We did this before, but we're going to do it again. Uh, so I'm going to agree to it. Don't trust the Lodge one bit. But it doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the Sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think. I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. That's right, Siri. You're right. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Zirel Shut possesses up, a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. That's her elfin name. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly and not through Geralt. You tell him, Siri. I'm gone. So we're coming upon one of those lynchpin lynch moments, uh, which really affects the ending. Not quite there, but it's coming up. Um, I'll go after her. 
Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. Come on, Yen. See ya. Triss and Yen. Oh. The Kaer Morin area was one of my favorite areas. It's small, but it's gorgeous. All right, we're level 30. We have 12 points available, apparently. We should look at that at some point. I'm actually gonna need uh, to, to look at some things again and remember them. So I definitely don't mind tips about uh, skills and potions and it's things. It's not working, don't you see? Because it's, it's been a minute. after a mere eight attempts. See it out. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. I'm not getting anywhere. We shall return to this later. So Avalok was the elf who uh, helped her make it when she was running from the wild hunt. Either. Geralt, please, not now. And he was stuck. He was cursed as Uma, was a in the park. ugliest man alive. But that's not the point. <laughs> what is? Avalok says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tom, is this? How do you do it? Before what? my DLC you save. To pull yourself together, focus. One second. No matter what's happening. Uh, so this is the linchpin one, and we want to do two. I think I know what might lift your spirits. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? The Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! You have to have a snowball fight with her. There's not a whole lot of snow. <laughs> You'll regret that. <laughs> I said you don't have to be good at everything before, but you have to choose this one. Okay, we got snowballs on three. We'll see about that. How do I use them? Uh oh, it's an R. No. Where is my snowball? Okay, I gotta figure out how to use them though. <laughs> I've got <laughs> three of them. Um, ah, crap. Good shot. Let's see. Let's go to the inventory. Can't do that now. Uh oh, I'm gonna blow it. Here, let's do a save here, just in case. I can't save right now. Same, same as the crossbow. Isn't the crossbow tab? It says I can't do that right now. Um, yeah, it's not right click, it's not left click. It's not either of my mouse buttons. Middle mouse? Oh, there we go. Thank you. I gotta hit her a certain number of times. Oh, ah. <laughs> You'll regret that. How do I get more? Uh, oh, don't let the Good snowballs shot. hit me. All right, we're going to have to start this again. Now that I know how. Take all. Yeah, hey! Land, nice. Oh, I can't dodge either. Okay, we got her once. That's cheating. Oh, okay, we gotta get some more. All right, here we go. We got this. All 
All right, we got this. Oh, oh not yet. You gotta aim really low. She's got a health bar for it. I'll cheat. Hey. Alright, we're becoming an expert snowball fighter now. He's really slow now, too. Oh, there we go. I was in walk mode. Hey, come here. All right, we almost died to the Siri boss monster, but we got it. You were right. That really works. Thanks. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Ooh, a sneaky one. <laughs> She's all, don't you dare. <laughs> don't you dare. So apparently there's five places you can make a choice like that, and you have to get three of them right. Geralt. We're gonna get all five right. Geralt, wake up! What? What? What's happening? Get up. You must go. I've saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Dunno. Enlighten me. Imlareth. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlareth will be drunk among his cohorts. Caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. How do you learn about the Sabbath? How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilark. He told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come. We shall talk on the way. Okay, this is another one. Uh, so, Valen. Lead on. Pressure, man. <laughs> <laughs> the timer. Ready? So let's go. That was another linchpin moment. And if you visit the Emperor first. Okay, so there's two good endings possible. So spoilers again here, but we're beyond that, right? Um one is she becomes she lives. Both of them she lives. One she becomes a witcher. Two, she becomes empress. Now, I think I want her to become a witcher. Because um, she just seems happier about it. That's what she's been trained for all her life. It wouldn't be bad having her as empress. But I don't think that's what she really wants. If you go visit the emperor first, then she becomes empress. If you go to Valen first, um, she becomes a witcher. So that one there was another key moment. So they're basically all the ones that are timed, it seems. I guess that's how you would know. The but I don't know how you'd know which one to get right place. without trial Art and error. Sabin, home of the ladies of the wood. The peasants feared coming here. And the barons thought the ladies of the wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the baron is. Hanged himself after his wife died. Daughter's in Novigrad. A true shame. Um, so to answer your question back there, Ray Matz, this is this is um, going back in my playthrough just before the obviously the main story ending. Um, I, d I haven't actually gone into the DLCs yet at all. They're waiting for me, and I was just at that point at the end of the story, but I decided to go back and get the ending right first. So so far, I haven't done anything from the DLCs. 
Here's the thing of the bad ending, she never returns. I, other two endings, she does. I believe she went to cyberpunk and lived there after the fight in the bad ending. That's right. <laughs> That's what she did. Or she is frozen, like uh, you said, like Captain America. Yeah. All right. But uh, we're going to get it right. And basically, all those time ones are it. And it's one of the two. I think it would be really hard to know which one's the better choice, really, and how to be a better dad. But basically, the rule of thumb is just trust her, let her do her thing, let her take the lead, um, and uh, just be kind of loose with it. It's more about freedom for her than it is about fatherly concern, right? Yeah. Oh my, you are missing the DLCs. They're absolutely amazing. Oh, I'm not going to miss them. I haven't done them yet. I had had enough after 134 episodes of uh, doing the whole main story and definitely needed a break. And this is what brought me back. We were going to jump right into them now, but we're fixing the ending first, and then we're going to jump right in. So it'll probably be next stream that we'll start the DLCs. Um, so we will, definitely. All right. I always do the white ones before the yellow. Ooh, I guess we lost focus. We stand to find Imlarith here. You sure? Avalok told me of beings who commune with the NL Elves. They can be found in every part of our world. In Velen, the Crones do this. Apparently, Imlarith came here at Eridin's behest to order the Crones to keep their eyes open and ears pricked in case Avalok were to seek shelter in his Velen hideout. Took the order literally judging by all the ears hanging in the woods. Think Imlarith might still be here? He craves the pleasures of the flesh, wine, sex. The crones indulge him, flatter his ego. I'm certain he'd not let this opportunity pass, and will be on Bull Mountain for the Sabbath. Um, so yeah, if you decline to visit the Emperor first, it sends you straight to this Bald Mountain quest. And one of the problems with me doing this is after two and a quarter years of being gone, we're going back to some of the endgame boss fights. Apparently, I got through them, but uh, yeah, I'm a little rusty at this moment, so we'll see how this goes. Be kind to me. You actually know this area? Centuries ago, it was a hallowed site for druids. But then the crones arrived, destroyed the Velen Circle, and deformed the sacred oak atop the mountain. An important feast is observed here annually. The Sabbath, they call it. All the local folk attend. I suspect Imlareth attends too. As the crone's guest. Seem to know it well. Havelock's a good tutor. Let's go. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. Alrighty. The peasant folk of Velen call this night the Feast of Gifts. I've no idea why. Havelock claims vanity is Imlarith's greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalog's student. We're walking rather slow. I don't seem to be able to sprint. We'll bring a gift for him. Death. That's right. He's, for folks who don't know, he is outsider. the leader of the Wild Hunt. Let them approach. But I think. They've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. But we fire us down that away with food and drink plenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. They're not very easy on the eyes. Um, let's try two. We won't join you at your fires, though we thank you for the invitation. Time we were on our way. You wish to see the ladies. I too hope to before I die. Go up the mountain and face old Thecla. She'll decide if you're worthy. Do just that. Farewell. Okay. Oh, now I can run. All right, which way are we going? And uh, let's uh, use this uh, forge up here. Where are you? Seen him about already. 
Oh, that's a blacksmith. Okay. I thought uh, it was the thing to improve yeah. your um, uh, to improve your. Uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> uh, to sharpen sharpen your sword or repair your armor. Not repair your armor, but kind of hone your armor. Uh, looks like I'm in pretty good shape here. I'm carrying a, some swords I'm not using. I'm using this silver sword here, apparently. Uh, let's check out our inventory. All right. Yeah, we just, we don't need him. So long. Right now I'm using the Griffin Steel Sword, Superior Sword, 227 to 277 damage, and the Silver Sword that does even a lot more. Hopefully that's good. That's what I was using before. I don't think I have anything better than that. So we'll go with that. Those are both uh, Witcher weapons. Look, a child. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. What's up, Johnny? Hey, you're back! Uh, and I see you found your lass! I'm Johnny! We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me. As I was... <laughs> having the pleasure of... Oh, tis a long story. They call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? We gotta climb the mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you, but I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass, she is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. Oh. Path to the peak starts there, past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key, so since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. The key. Why do you doubt we can get it? Good grief! You're worse than children! <laughs> worse than children! Three souls are allowed atop the mountain, and only strapping young lads or comely lasses among them. They get the key, open the gate, and meet the ladies. I believe I qualify. But he's old and ugly. What good is he? <laughs> he's Pretty old and ugly. Finding lost voices. Then go find the voice of reason. It'll tell you to turn back. There's no fooling with the ladies. Okay, we gotta try. Right, let's ask the crone's question, though. We're here to find an elf named Imlarith. Siri thinks he might be a guest of the crone's. Big bloke, in full plate? Going the right way. He's atop the mountain, all right. You've seen him? Saw him in the bog first. Water froze beneath his horse's hooves. Then I saw him again yesterday, heading up this path. Why are you looking for him? He killed my friend. Wouldn't seek revenge if I were you. Even the ladies bow and scrape before that one. All right, we got to try. Got to get to the summit. Simple as that. It's Thecla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck and do hope we meet again someday. Okay, so I kind of remember this. We got to do a trial for Thecla to convince her how young and virile we are. It's not ready. You've got to wait. If only their gifts are plenty. It's not ready. <laughs> oh, can we say hi to the doggo? Hi, doggo. Mm. Who's that? Well, 
Come on, come closer, girl. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. Never mind. Got the answer. <laughs> oh my god. With I'll a sniff. You, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. Um. S Siri, what do you think? Siri. Wonderful. Who wouldn't want to meet the ladies? My companion comes with me. <laughs> what else has the cat dragged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar, and eyes like a viper. Aye. Stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. <laughs> I reject ye, freak. I love you too. The girl will ascend alone. Appearances can be deceiving. I'm worthy. You misjudged me. I'm worthy as anyone. Girl? He's sprier than any youth. Only smells like corpses because he kills monsters. And he'll kill any who stand in his way. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right you may appeal my choice. But to do so you must best the challenge. I'll take your challenge. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse. So they call it the Defiers Auron. Gotta love series makeup. Now, bring me the coin. <coughs> the eye shadow. Ah! Something's afoot. Okay. Something's nigh. So we gotta go, but uh I don't can we jump here? Oh, Apparently not. <laughs> oh, God. Let's see how far back that puts us. There's got to be an autosave in there somewhere, yeah? Probably right there. Death one. All right, can we... Uh... Something's afoot. I think Sometimes there was enough. another way we had to get there. Uh, let's try to jump it again. Further. There we go. We got a drowner. Where is my crossbow? This is the way to get these. Uh, where is my crossbow? Okay, hold on. Don't hit me. Don't hurt me. Uh, we want to put this here. There we go. All right, crossbow. These guys are very sensitive to crossbows underwater. All right, let's get some breath. I don't know if we're worried about looting the guts. I don't know if they have guts if we do it that way. All right, we'll get back in the swing of things here. We got the coin. It's dark. Okay, where's the top? Or do we gotta just go back out? Mm. 
No good. Okay, we're good. That was it. Two drowners. Oh. Well, that's a big thing. Okay. All right. Uh, I think the way out's here. <laughs> we'll leave that alone for now. Sure, we can kill it, though. How's, what's the way out here? It says this way. Here we go. she at? She is... I'm terrible at following these mini-maps. Alright, she's up here. I was beginning to worry. Come, let's get the key. Something's afoot. They're back. What do you want? You might want to warm up on smaller guys first, yeah. Got that coin you tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. We well, should have thrown Nothing it in there I then. Can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Marika will open the gate for you. Now go. Okay, we're worthy. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. Stop one. You're a witcher. You've dived in murkier waters. <laughs> yeah, I have to tell you about the time I hunted a Zugo. Stop whining. Last of the chosen Ooh, that's a big word. Or just a wolf, I guess. Hello. I'm sorry, I can't read your name, but hello. Seen him about already. It is a very good game. Crown Jewel of RPGs. Okay, here we go. Travel the path to the peak. That sounds like a troll. I hope we don't have to kill him. I like trolls. West Slavic name. Artyom. What's up, Artyom? I just, yeah, I can't read Cyrillic. Okay, let's go. Fugus. <clears throat> What's your name, girl? What's yours? Not a troll. Your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? I passed the trial. Here's proof. I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Oren. A death sentence. Okay. You have to fight him, huh? It's probably an oil or something I could use, but uh Serious here. So she tricked me. He's good. One tough son of a bitch. We've no time to lose. I'll tend to Imlarith, you take the crones. Avalark said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlarith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> uh. 
Uh oh, it's a tie. Damn it! Two out of three. He won. Fate has decided. Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain, you face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. Hopefully I got that one right. It didn't have a timer on it. I must get down there. Let's see, what quest is this? This is Bald Mountain. I'm just going to double check real quick. I don't want to get this wrong. So... Yeah, the Bald Mountain quest... All right, I don't think that was a critical decision. Pretty sure of it. So let's go on with this. If anybody knows different, let me know. <laughs> All right, so we're Siri now. Siri has a, she's got like a flash thing she can do, right? She needs to go this way, I presume. Be nice if I could see. Penetrate to the heart of the tree's roots. Oh hell. I guess I must jump. All right. Oops. Ah! Hit the side. <laughs> All right, where are we going? Those are the crones in their uh, more pleasant form. I did not put that mod on this time. I forgot, but hopefully uh, YouTube won't ding me. <laughs> and knew no bitterness. They might. Yum, yum. Lovely. Yeah, when I did the first playthrough, I remember to put the no nudity mod on. Give them a little wrap on their top there. YouTube has a lot of other things to deal with, right? That was a very stealth series. Okay. Yeah, never judge a uh, a boob by its Welcome, cover. Welcome, child of the Elder Blood. We knew you would return. Yep. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. Okay, I think it's it's space. Yeah, there it is. You die 
I don't know if she's got a heal. This is gonna take a minute. I'm just gonna try to avoid as much damage as possible. I've already taken some, apparently. Ooh. I think she just heals over time, right? Ooh, we're half down. At least get one out of here. Oh, ouch. Naughty, naughty girl. Naughty, naughty girl. <laughs> naughty, naughty. Oh, sneaky. Getting low. Took a hit. It went down. Hold still. I can phase right through him, apparently. You will die here now. I like going right through him and attacking him from behind. She must be Two down. Naughty, naughty girl. And my health is is going up. Get her, Siri. Bats hurt too. You will die here now. We got this. Naughty, naughty got it. Got it. You <laughs> love that wisdom. All right. So that is actually a medieval beekeeper's outfit. That basket she has on her face. Yeah. Sneaky. Just took my medallion. Now, in the bad oh, ending, at the summit. I went to their uh, hut and got her medallion back, but it was very sad because she had not come back. And all the creatures of the swamp were all gathering around to do a massive, massive ambush of me. He's a thief. All right, so now Geralt 
has to find Imlareth. And this is going to be a tough fight. So, I'm not sure, um, actually, what is, uh, as far as, like, oils, what you would use against a uh, high elf, uh, if anything. I never got too into the potions. I usually just carry Thunderbolt, which makes me hit harder, and Swallow, which is basically a slow health potion. Um... In a way, bad ending is better than than right than right for when for when she will return. Yes. Um. Yeah, I don't know if any of these would actually work against him. Uh, let's actually look at the. What do you mean, the bestiary or actually the the glossary? Right, it's, uh, characters. Uh. Imlareth. Imlareth, a general, he's a general of the Wild Hunt, and a frequent guest in Geralt's Nightmares, has been chasing Ciri for quite some time, striving to deliver her to his ruler, Aradin. Powerful and brutal warrior had fought in countless battles and campaigns for conquest wedged by the Ain... I don't know how to pronounce that. In other, wor in other worlds, he prized physical uh, confrontation above all else, seeking out direct bloody skirmishes where opponents pit their strength, agility, and training against each other in a contest of death. He attacked Kaer Morin along with the rest of the hunt. There the Keeper keeps defenders witnessed heart-wrenching proof of the warrior's dangerous might. Vesemir, who had spent most of his long life with a sword in his hand, heroically stood to fight this foe, but to everyone's great despair was bested after a bloody and hard-fought confrontation and perished at this monster's hand. Regardless of race or birth, most warriors share common desires and delights. Immolarith was no exception. Okay, so it doesn't say a weakness. I don't know that there is. Um, I think, what do I have? Do I have uh That's Ard, Irden, Igni, Quen. Ah, t -t 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 we, I think we, we are in Death March difficulty. Uh, let's see if Ard does anything against him. Knock him over. If not, we'll do Igni is five. Quen, if we need it, is on six. Oh, and we have a uh, place of power. Place of power. From it. Yeah. Okay, so that gives me a buff, hopefully. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. We're good. <laughs> we're good. Geralt's movie movement has always been a bit janky. I can switch to walk, but then he's so slow. All right, we got it. All right. He's here having a good time. What's up, buddy? Looking kind of fierce. hippie girls who don't shave their legs. The sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? I'm here alone. A lie which will change nothing. Then her. Don't 
Okay. It's on. We'll definitely take a thunderbolt. Okay, that does nothing. I'll switch it to uh, Igni. That didn't do a whole lot either. Gonna have to break through that. Take this real slow. Damn, you're ugly. Ah. Ouchie. my thunderbolt or excuse me my uh my swallow It's a little dirty to use the uh, signs. Dodge when I tell you to. No. Oh my god. Does this pause things? Yeah, it's there. R, F, is it T? There it is. Alright, get back in the flow. Hey, Moist. What's going on? I'm using all heavy hits on him. Does that even do any good when I hit the shield? I don't think so. Gotta get back here. Okay. Sneaky. Okay, shield's gone. Oh god, he's teleporting all over the place. Slow down, buddy. Yeah, 
Okay, now it's time. Go. Nope. Go. Okay, now. Go. It gets us a little tiredness right there. Rolling around on the floor. Get him. Can't get a second hit, just the one. I don't like this phase of the fight. Ooh, I'm in bad shape. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Hold still. Hey. Gosh darn it. Lost my rhythm. Get him. Cheats. Get him. Oh, crap. Ouch. Get him. Nope, get him. Lost my chance. Let's get that one hit. Right now. Chipping away. Oh, I get the finisher. Who taught you to fight like this? The Witcher you slew. Ha <laughs> Igni in the face. Looks like Darth Vader now. With his own weapon. Get him. Get him. Ooh. to do it first try it was a little rough looks like barbecue mm -mm. we did it 
Barely. How'd it go down there? I slew only two of the crones. The third fled with Vesemir's medallion. It was Vesemir's medallion. I memento. Now let's just keep being positive. Coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed. From the start. Now to find Eredin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. Simple as that. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses of the Lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Uh, not quite yet. Give me a minute. I'm old. Need more rest. Hmm. You are, and you I want to make sure I loot Imlarith. Stay a bit longer. Where is he? Is he up here? Yeah. I gotta loot my victim, girl. Oh, my stuff's damaged. Where is he? I'll see him on the map, actually. Guess it wouldn't be on this map. Do we not get to loot him? Hmm. Maybe he's up. No, that's where we came up. Is that him? There he is. Magic acorn. I knew what that was at a certain point. I've forgotten. All right, let's uh, repair our stuff. So this is 90%. Uh, what's the durability at? It's at 47%. This one... Let's do one of these. Is that how we do it? No. Nope. Nope. That didn't... That's the wrong thing. Um, do we do it in our inventory? It's been so long. Let's put that back. Uh, select slot. Oh, that's the armor's one. Wait, okay, escape. Uh, let's do. Let's just use one of these. Oh, these are all armors. Okay. Armor, armor, armor. Do I have no weapon repair kits? That doesn't work again. We know that. Okay, I guess I got to get some weapon repair kits. Unless there was another way that you repaired your weapons. Or do I got to take it to a blacksmith? I forget how that works. Apparently, I don't have the right thing. Um, maybe in my crafting? What was craft? Crafting's O. No, this you can only do... Um, at Blacksmith 2, I think. Uh, crafting components. Just seeing if I can make them. Blacksmith can repair? Okay, gotta go do a Blacksmith. Can also buy kits from them. I know some of these I was able to make at a certain point. I can make all these. All right, so we got to do that. All right, let's talk to Siri. So, off to Novigrad then. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's get going. Let's go. The 
oak is dead. The oak, the crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? I got one, yours if you want it. Learn to live without them. Do I give him the acorn? I guess so. Can I do a save here? No, I cannot save. I guess so. I don't I forget what they're uh what they're good for. Let's look it up. Since we're uh this is our second time through. What kind of mid acorn was that? What's your magic acorn? Let them suffer for abandoning their kids. Okay, so yes. They're used to sometimes uh, ground up for fertilizer to yield a large harvest. They're mixed with medicines to cure illnesses. Um, Remat, Remat says, let them suffer. All right, we'll let them suffer. <laughs> Do we get a reward if we give it to them? I think we only get the one. The magic acorn, here we go. Oh. We're supposed, to, if we eat it, we get two skill points. Yeah, so let's uh, there we're keeping be any it. Any more acorns need to get by without them. What now? This is no longer no man's land, it's no longer the lady's land, it's all yours. But you just gotta get by to normally. Do? Come, Geralt, it's time. Manage on your own, on your own, manage. Yeah, I never looked things up during the first playthrough, but uh, we're trying to finish it out right this time. So it's okay to look things up this time because we did it all blind once. All right, can I... Can I eat it now? The little write-up of here says I was supposed to eat it immediately. Oh, it's looking so nice. Then none the humans. Thought it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after. Mages left. Hunters needed a new quarry. I don't like them. Hatred and prejudice will never be eradicated. And witch hunts. Will never be about witches. Have I played through Cyberpunk? I did. That's the key. Humans always fear the I did a full playthrough. I'm it's waiting for uh was it Throne and Liberty? Against the other races. Or uh and no, that's ages. a that's an MMO. <laughs> I'm waiting for the uh, DLC. But yeah, I played through it. I loved it. Some tankers with guests. Geralt! Siri! When I learned Geralt had found you. Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. Where have you two been? Imlarith, we hunted him down. Just finished hunting down the crowns of Velen and a general of the Wild Hunt. <laughs> well, Is that all? Busy more than that, haven't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Thanks. Gladly take some. But we 
me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, Geralt. I have a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. I needed the break from Conan Moist. I, we played it four months straight and played the heck out of it. And it was at the point when I wasn't like dying to play it anymore. I thought it's time to switch it up a little bit. I'll be back. With the server still up. Let's see uh, uh, the sorceresses. Where are they then? Anyone here besides us? Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs. Don't go there, there, Raleigh. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't that song you. is lore Imagine breaking. that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the ruby suite. What's up, Told man? How are you? Waiting too. Stop it. Yeah. That whole toss a coin to your witcher, man. The, he, he's not a banger like that. What the heck is all that about? Uh... Okay. Gave him your best room? Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the ruby. Hasn't peeked out since. Barely eats, drinks Song is water, the worst. And the only thing I've heard from him is, I wish to know when... I mean, the, the TV Zoe series alive. was the worst. Thanks. I never even finished it. Looks like I'll have my hands full. Terrible <sighs> adaptation. It's a travesty. All right, so let's see in here. Can we eat this now? So this is supposed to give us uh, skill points. Let's see, how many skill points do we have right now? Um, I've got 12. I haven't even used a lot of them. I should look at this. <laughs> I got stuck, I guess, trying to figure out what I wanted next. I got two slots open here with nothing in them. Oh, because I needed another... Another mutagen, maybe? I gotta remember how this works. Alright, so in my... Inventory... We eat this. Can we eat it now? Consume. Yes! I gave us two more... Skill points. The coin is more general witcher lore based on their problem with creating monsters to still have a livelihood. But that was before Geralt was even a witcher. Well, there's some stuff way back in the short stories where they're definitely traveling around and they're kind of hard on their luck. Um, but the whole thing is that being his theme song. It's just like, nah, man. Geralt's got more pride than that. Doing good, man. <coughs> Figured I'd drop in and see how you were doing. Make a reference to a song I know you hate. <laughs> I'm just so disappointed by the whole series, that one, and that so many people know it from that. I mean, Henry Cavill left, so that tells you uh, how well they were doing with that. <laughs> yeah, I was really, uh, I watched The uh, Last of Us, um, the first uh, episode on HBO, and that is an example of an adapt adaptation done right. They even changed some things, right? But what they changed was good, was okay, you know? And it's definitely not lore-breaking. They're kind of like, you know, a, a, a series TV adaptation has to be different than the game, right? I get that. But the, uh, the people who did the showrunners for the, um, the Witcher series, they didn't even seem apparently like the game or the books, and they wanted to change it the way they wanted to change it. And it's just, yeah. If you go to the Reddit, to the Witcher room, and every, the subreddit, uh, everybody hates it. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't fit Geralt very well, but his hatred of it is very fitting. Yeah, it's true. I guess I'm kind of personifying Geralt when I hate that song. You're halfway into the first episode. Took a break to join you for a bit. Oh, cool, man. I am honored that you would take a break from an episode of The Last of Us to, uh, to join me. I know how important that game was to you. You gonna play the game in March? I am. I am. I've been looking forward to it. I've never played it. 
Um, I've been tempted a few times to get the PS5 to go ahead and play it, but that's coming out in March. PS5s are available right now, so probably what's going to happen is uh, I'm going to play the PC version of The Last of Us in March, and then I'll pick up a PS5 and we'll do The Last of Us 2. I've watched someone do a playthrough of uh, part one before, um, so I know what I know the story, but I still want to play it myself. Um, but I am not spoiled on The Last of Us 2, except I know what happens, the major thing that happens with the first act, but I didn't go beyond there, because that's as far as Arali got in his playthrough. <laughs> you enjoy the show? Yeah, I'm just a little bit too much of a purist of Witcher lore. Um, or, not really a purist, but I think they just... They blew it, man. They blew it. But if you enjoy it, you know, no problem. I mean, the way to go by things that are made from books or, or, or games or whatever is to see them as their own thing, right? Rather than trying to make them, like, have to stick, you know, blow by blow with the games or the books. So you got to approach it like that and see it as a whole separate entity. Um, but I like the books and I like the game. Personally, I'm not a fan of the series for The Witcher, but that's okay. It's okay. There's plenty of other things to watch, and I've got the game. So, hey. Um, let's just look at the skills real quick while we're in here. Um, and let me figure out what we're doing here. So, in the blue stuff, we've got... Uh, this is for Quen. Oh, wait. No. Igni. Okay. Damage dealt by Igni also permanently weakens. So, okay, blue is... Blue is signs. Red is combat. Uh, green is alchemy. And then... Uh, yeah, brown is survival, I think. And then these are mutagens. So I gotta remind myself all this. Good night, Warlord. Yeah, I, I, I watched season one of The Witcher, and I got like an episode and a half into season two, and I was just like, ah, uh, yeah, <laughs> no, couldn't do it. So I think these are augmented when they're with the thing of the same color. I don't know why I've got this here. When it should be with the browns, right? Do I have anything that goes here? Do the browns not get a mutagen to go with them? Like, why wouldn't that go there? Actually, let's see. Let's mess around a little bit. Um, So yeah, eating food regenerates vitality, increases maximum vitality, increases carry weight. Uh, so I need some greens and a red, right? When vitality reaches zero, it'll be restored with a bonus of 67%. Oh, so I might, this might have saved me actually, because I saw my vitality went way up when I was fighting Imlarith. So I got one save from death. Fast attack increased, damage increased by 30%. So I need a uh, heavy attack damage, don't I? Fast attack, strong attack, defense, marksmanship. So let's put a uh, point into this. Oh, I did already, didn't I? Put it here. All right, so that's my... Yeah, my strong attack now is increased by 30%. Excellent. Arrow deflection. I gotta remember how to do parries. I don't think any of these do anything though unless they're in here. So yeah, what do I got here? 
increased my poison, my, uh, what my oil on my blades do. So this is protection against the monster type that you've oiled your blades for. This is more tolerance to potions. This is, oh wait. That is, but this is, um, That's increasing my maximum toxicity. He gets messed up when he drinks too many potions. Which I don't do a lot of, but I, I do the Thunderbolt and the uh, Swallow. Ray Mats, I have notes from him of he told me all these potions he took that made him like super OP. Yeah, he gets really spooky. He tolerated season two, Ray Mats. I think maybe we'll just increase our toxicity. Let's put a... Do we gotta put points into this or what? Yes. And we'll upgrade it. Okay, so every known level one, two, or three alchemy formula increases maximum toxicity and potion duration time is increased by 15%. We'll put that down here. That synergizes with this. Um, maybe. And then we got this little thing, increasing Axie. But we've strengthened Ard. Our shield explodes when we use Gwen. And Igni melts armor. All right, that's pretty good. Uh, this is a major one down here where we did strength training. And I'll give a look over this between episodes, but at least we should use all our slots here. Hence, you're playing New Game Plus where all the potion build can be carried over. What only works in DLCs? Remats? Okay, so yeah, so our assign intensity is plus 40%, our attack power is plus 40% in general, and our vitality is plus 450. Alright, that looks pretty strong for now. Just getting back into oh, this though. Alright, we gotta talk to everybody. Got to talk to Avalok. Oh, it looks like I need to meditate too. Let's uh, let's meditate a little bit to renew our, my potions. And we're gonna need to also visit a smith to re repair my weapons. Let's go do that real quick, and then we'll come back and we'll talk to everybody. I have the strength for anything. We lives. Since a mere idiot, two days road from the Zima. Thanks for your help. The super OP potion build. Won't spoil much when the DLC, the mutagen system gets an upgrade, which makes using potions worth it. Okay. Where am I going? I'm going here. Let's see if we can buy some weapon kits too. That elf weaponsmith. Yeah, and there's one oh. right here. Oh. This guy. So you can see all the reflections in the water. That's the ray tracing. The And then there's lighting. The whole lighting is much better. Now, in the city, you can feel the FPS. 
And the water looks way better than it did before, too. And the uh, textures. If I press U, we've got photo mode now. And you can see, you can get as close as you want to the armor. Until you go through them. And the, uh, the textures really hold up. Oh, you know what? I had a different armor at the end of the game. Did I not make it yet? Oh, we didn't do that yet. Yeah, I was wearing uh, armor with uh, with red outlines. I have to go back and look what it was. Uh, right now I'm wearing Superior Griffin. Anyway, let's go see this guy. Need something sharpened, reforged. What's up, Haze all day? Uh, let's see. Oh, we can play cards. <laughs> We're good. I, I do like want to play some Gwent, though. For me. But I think, think I've won everything from him. Um, so, repair. Here we go. We want him to repair this. Yes. Sweet. And I don't know all this stuff. I have the kits for that. That's fine. That's at 99%. Yeah, we'll do all that with kits. That's fine. Um, and let's see what he's got for sale. What do, do you I have care? on offer? I heard Gwent. I remember you not liking it. No, I loved it. I just used to tease Jay because she like kind of tolerated it. <laughs> I love Gwent. And Jay was like, ugh, Gwent. <laughs> He's like, okay, go ahead, play. I'll go make lunch. And then uh, we'd work it out like that. Yeah, so I like to tease her. Exactly. All right, so we got some weapon repair kits here. Uh, let's get, those are 76, those are 157. Uh, let's buy that. Let's buy that. And let's buy that. Okay, cool. And I just I gotta kind of trust that um, so long I had myself in a decent position from last time. I'm sure there's ways that I can min max it. Um, but let's go see armor dude up here, and let me see if I can remember what the other armor I ended up with is. It does work out well. Otherwise, you have a hard time stepping away for adulting and food. Yes. Well, well, yeah, no, I, I kicked butt and Gwent. I did not finish collecting all the cards, though. Now, apparently there's been a change with this guy. Where'd he go? He's not on here. Day, Maybe we need to meditate? This guy. He used to always say, top-notch swords, uh, but he's an armorer. And they apparently have fixed that. Let's see. Although he does have swords there. Welcome. 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 It's hilarious because even the few streams I missed, he'd mention me. And when I went back to watch the video, I did die laughing. Uh, so let's see what we were trying to make. Uh, Mastercrafted armor. I think you could make it. Mastercrafted armor. I think you could make me some. Ooh. I did get my journeyman's papers, but I've yet to make anything akin to a masterwork. Or was it not him? You might try in Velen. A dwarf there goes by Fergus. He might help. Guildsmen claim there's no one better anywhere south of the Ponta. Yeah, Fergus was... Actually, it was his helper, the woman, that was doing that, right? And we had done her stuff. So he can't make it. Willing to craft something for me? Um, but I just want to remember what it was and if I have the stuff for it yet. I'm wearing that. I'll have to go back to the other save and see what it was. 
we won't worry about it right now, although having better armor could be helpful. Alright. So long. Was it Wolven I had? Oh, you love the Wolven. And let's take a look at my quest real quick, too. Yeah, so this is it for the main quest, the one we're on. Um, I have... This is, uh, this is Hearts of Stone. This is Blood of Wine. As soon as we finish getting this good ending, we will do both of those. This is the High Stakes Gwent Tournament. Maybe we should just uh, take a left turn straight into that, right? Apparently, I haven't done that yet here. But we can do that afterwards, I think, right? Yeah, those are all Gwent. These are races. This is one I skipped. I'm not going to kill the troll. Okay, so the only one of these I didn't do was the High Stakes Gwent Contest. Um, not Witcher Contracts, but Treasure Hunts. There are some upgrades. Here we haven't finished fi finding. Let's do a uh, let's do a save right here, and let's load this before I lose it. Uh, evil's soft touches. Trolls are sweet babies. I do. I love trolls. You would suggest doing heart first and then end with blood and wine? Okay. I was considering doing blood and wine first because I don't know anything about it except that you get a winery. <laughs> I'd like to have a winery. I just wanted to see what this is. This is, uh... Oh yeah, the master crafted woven armor. That's what I did. So this is the one you like, Damon. So I got to finish getting that, making that. Okay. All right, let's go back to this. We might want to do that first because... Uh, it would be um, good to have the best armor for the end of the game. Blood and wine ending is a good way to end the series. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Maybe we should go till we get the winery and then uh, go back, unless that's the end. I don't know, but I'll probably just take your advice then. Um, okay, so uh, for treasure hunts, I did all these, I just gotta find the gauntlets. Let's go get our gauntlets and make that real quick. We've got the boots, the trousers. I assume the chest. Where is this? Somewhere else. Probably want to make sure I fix the pasties for the DLC. <laughs> Is it naughty? Is it naughty? I personally, at this point, uh, don't mind it being naughty, but yeah. There's the, the monetization issue. I mean, I think the violence is worse, honestly. So, world map, we want to go to Skellige for this, apparently. And it is over here. All right, let's go. Uh, boop. 
Oh, no, we need to go here. It's not that bad. Not that I make a whole lot off that anyway. <laughs> but it'd be nice in case these episodes blow up for some reason. Okay, so we want to go this way. Dead bear. Oh, this is actually a good opportunity for me to show you um, the difference here. Let's uh, let's make it daytime again with the Nvidia Hairworks. Still not in the sun, but. Okay, that's without hair works. And then if we put on hair works. Oh, I think it's in graphics. Did it not go? Huh. Maybe because he's been long dead. Or maybe he's like a prop. That's why. But uh, generally they foof out when you turn the hair works on. But we'll go back and turn it off then. Just wanted to show you guys. Those scenes are there, but not as much as compared to the main game. We'll see. I wanna. We'll see if uh, YouTube dings me for that scene with the crows. See if their algorithm can pick it up in a game. Twitch has a more sensible policy. They like nudity is okay as long as it's not the point. You know, in a game. If it's just part of the game and you don't make a big deal out of it, it's fine. But if you're like focusing on it, then they have issue. Now we'll have to see why I didn't get this before. I think I might have been stuck. I know Maybe what not. this means. Hmm. Okay, we're getting that. Got a baddie over here somewhere. The fiend. Oh, we gotta kill a fiend. Alright, let's uh I think fiends are beasts, yeah. <coughs> let's see. Where's the fiend? Oh, they're a relic. All right, we need relic oil. So, which one's the relic oil? It's this guy. All right. What's up, buddy? Looks like he's about to charge. No? Ouch. Oh, man. Let me up. Crap. Oh, he cast the darkness thing on me. Cheater. Ran off to its lair to lick its wounds. Need okay. To track it down. Ate only the entrails. Fussy. Hmm. all over the body but those indicate feeding he died from a blow to the head oh the fiends are related to the uh, hippie ladies what are they called those weren't suck you by those were something else right so 
still wants me to do something. Eat only the entrails. Fussy. Oh, looky. No. Maybe he's up inside here. Yeah, I think we gotta go in there. Alright, let's find the way in. Maybe we got stuck here before and couldn't get in. Ooh, loot. Oh, here it is. The gauntlets. We got them. Nice. Okay. That's it. So let's go back, um, see who can make those. That would be... Here, let's go find a, uh, signpost. That would be back at the Crow's Perch, yeah? What's this? Oh, this is a contract still. Oh, we might as well finish that since we're on it. Why not? And then we'll go back here. All right, let's go back in here. I like the fiend, but might as well finish the contract. Succubus. It is a succubus, okay. Loot. We got a diagram. Elven steel sword. Night the fire. <laughs> Why not? Sure. Oh, here we go. Ran this way. See if we can do this without breaking our ankles. They said our ankles are stronger now. This looks lairish. For folks who don't know, I am a loot goblin. Hard time passing up any loot. Yep. Oh. Okay, there we go. He took the road. go. Well, it's still back here, huh? Not do what to now? the other side. All right, that's where I was going.
There he is. We need to renew our uh, relic oil. Uh, was one of these? Oh no, I still got some on it. I will renew it. Fine. And we've got art up. Um, one more thing. Let's see what their weakness is. Their weakness is just bombs, which I don't use much. I mean, I have them, but uh, we'll go ahead and put Igni up. Won't get away this time. What now, you piece of filth? Oh, be nice to him, girl. Hey, don't do that. No running away. Ouchie. Yowchie. Let's have a little water. A little swallow. Why not a little thunderbolt? We got this. Did the contract. Collect the trophy from the fiend. Can walk through them. Do I gotta put this away? Maybe. Was it from its guts or something? Dead. Just dead. The terrain is a little annoying. Dead. Just dead. How do I get a trophy from it? I know I gotta cut its head off. Or something like that. Am I not remembering something? Seen a prompt. What do I do? I thought he was kind of pretty, actually. Am I supposed to equip a knife or something? Hey, Mats. How do I get the trophy? I thought I just got a prompt. Oh, I saw a loot. Here it is. Fiend trophy. Never mind. I got it. Oh, yeah. And then he does the animation. Okay. His guts were in the bushes. Avenged those boys. Had at least. Use it with Witcher senses. I should have done that. Yeah, we got it. So, uh, let me see. For here, we got the Fiend trophy. But, um, where's the other trophies? Here we go. Which one do we want? We don't need to worry about XP necessarily. 
10% chance to dismember. Let's do that one. I guess the rest of these just give XP. Okay. Oh, lovely. <laughs> What's up, Roach? Thank you for showing up. Um, so we need to go to this. That's to my right. Slower. Looks like some folks bugged out enough they had to go collect a reward before it allowed them the trophy. Run, Weird. Roach. Come on now. Okay, so we want to go. That master armorer was back in. Was it Valen? Wherever Crow's Perch is. Where was Crow's Perch? Here we go. I know one of the things I thought they were going to do was put the uh, signpost inside here. That's fine. So yeah, we'll get our armor fitted out and then we'll continue on with the good ending. I remember running up this many times. Poor Baron. The big jerk. First the armies, they watch at you, Claude. Huh? So I think we did the quest where she became the armorer, right? Geralt, good of you to come by. What can I do for you? Interesting accent. Here to play Gwen. <laughs> See if she can do armor made. Witcher's armor. Okay. So let's see if we have the stuff now. Superior woven armor, right? That's what we want. Oh, we need the enhanced woven armor. What was the one I had before? Was it superior or enhanced? Rest in peace, Baron. Um, let's see. So, let's look at my uh, quest log again. Let's see what I just got. Take care now. I just got... Does it say? Oh, these are all in uh, alphabetical order. Okay. Um, let's see what I have in my stash here. I think that's the ticket. What's your business? Let's see if I have the previous version. <laughs> of the woven armor, and that will tell me what I need to upgrade to, right? I think the stash was in here. Yes. Series old room. 
Okay. Warriors. Mastercrafted. Oh, and I need to uh, get to level 34. I think that's the deal here. All right. I think we can see in here, though, what we can make. That's why I don't have it yet. Uh, chest armor. Wolven. That's regular woven. All right. Well, I wouldn't have the chest piece because I already have that. Um, let's look at maybe legs, trousers. Okay. Yeah, these are level 34. Can I make a uh, superior? Enhanced woven trousers. I had all this figured out before. Woven trousers. I don't see woven anything in here except this one. Oh, what, what am I wearing? Griffin. Okay, so it doesn't seem like I can use it till I'm level 34, but I can maybe use the superior one, right? Um, sorry I'm taking so long on this guy, so I just got to remember all this stuff. So, chest armor. So the superior, mastercrafted. Uh, it's made from superior. And that you can wear level 29. This gives me 180 armor. And the griffin I'm wearing, it's 165. This I was able to wear since level 26. Um, and apparently I got to start all the way at the beginning of it. Okay, well, let's get to level 34 because we've got the um, we've got the mastercrafted chest piece. So no point to go all the way up making our own set up to superior and still have the mastercrafted. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've figured that out. I remember that now. So let's wait till we're level 34 and then we'll go back and we'll make the whole set. And it looks like right, everything but all, the chest. You won't. We have to uh, craft from scratch and take it all the way up with the upgrades. Got it. All right. Oh, they did put one in here now. I just had to find it. This is an upgrade. You used to always have to run all the way out again. So let's go c collect our reward for the, um, the beast, the fiend, and get back on track. Okay. I have, that was a little bit of a tangent, but I reminded myself what we need to do. What school gear are you trying to maintain? I'm just using whichever one's the highest, <laughs> generally. <laughs> I'm not smart enough to pick one over the others. Although I do prefer heavier armor, I think. Forget them. I'll bear you songs. I just kept upgrading to whatever I could make. Well, you say anything? Greetings. Any tidings? 
Bad ones, your son's dead. Bad ones. Your son's dead, killed by a fiend. All I could do was avenge him. I told him, son, nothing good ever came out of Pharaoh. Stay home. Your time will yet come for adventures and glory. Your reward. This gold brought me no luck. May it serve you better. Okay, we got our contract. Got some XP. Let's go back now to finishing the main story. Dead tired, huh? And then, pretty sure we're good. The, uh... Gotta fix the damage shrine. <laughs> I think we cleaned all these up at the end last time. We had to make sure we're done with all the ones with, um... What's his face in the Radovid thing? Because that has an effect on the end, too. Uh, what's his name? Spy dude? Big spy dude who's pretending to be one of the gangsters in Novigrad. Um, looks like we did all his stuff. If not, more will come later. All right. Go get the heavy armor and Skellige. Um, Dijkstra, yeah. I was making sure I did all the side quests with Dijkstra. Let's stay on track here, uh, Bayman, and we'll we can work on more armors later. I already had enough of a little side tangent there, but I wanted to show people how to get the good ending. So I mean, we still got a bunch of work to go to get there. So let's go back to here. Um, I'm gonna keep going on with the Witcher. We've got a good, not quite a month, three weeks of, of space before something else comes up, another game. So we're going to be progressing along here. Um, but if I go on the quest for a different armor, we're going to uh, spend the rest of the episode doing that. So it looks like I've done most of the Dijkstra stuff. I forget if I've killed Radovid yet or not. Alright, we've got to talk to everybody. We've got to talk to Avala. We've got to talk to Yennefer. we got to take, help Siri take care of her business in Nova, Novograd. we got to talk to Triss. Uh, we don't care about Dandelion. Or Voltan right now. And this is one of the ones where we have to get the answer with... Uh, we got to get it right with um, Siri. Anybody home? Not here. We can loot stuff, though. Dandelion's my buddy. I can loot his stuff, right? If you want to know, read the end part of Radovet in the archive. It should be have updated based on story progression. Okay. Um... That's not bestiary. What is that one? That one is uh, characters. Radovid. Uh, I don't see him here. Oh, here he is. 
This is the guy who was leading all the witch hunts and stuff. <laughs> Looks like not yet. So that'll probably come up as part of this. I guess that's going to be main quest. Where's everybody? I guess they're on the next floor. Okay, here's Triss. Have a chat with Triss. Poor Triss. Broke her heart. Greetings, Triss. Have you lost your mind? You went after Imlarith by yourselves? To the south? How could you put Suri in danger? Uh, calm down, it went well. Come on, we came out of it fine. Can't say the same for Imlarith. That's the sole comfort I find in this. But it's no justification. You know what might have happened? But it didn't. I was there. Had the situation under control. Mind if we change the subject? So I don't think we had anything critical with Triss there, but that was... Whenever it has those little timers, it's definitely something... Some linchpin. But uh, we're not romancing Triss, so hopefully that's all right. I didn't, I didn't do any research on this one. Past some pyres on the way in, non-humans. Past burning pyres on the way into town, non-humans on them. Things grow worse by the day. No mages left in the city, so the hunters had to find someone else to victimize. We need to resolve everything as quickly as possible and leave Novograd. Any success with the lodge? Anyone out there willing to help? It doesn't look good. Ida outright refused. While Francesca won't budge from her little realm with a war rage. We don't know about Frangilla. Haven't been able to contact her. And the others? Kira? Margarita? Philippa? Kira... thought too much of her charm. Tried to buy her way into Radovid's graces. Offered to make a powerful weapon for him. I tried to talk her out of it, but she refused to listen. Radovid laughed in her face. Ordered her captured. Then... Oh, Kira is impaled. Kira Metz was manipulative, a schemer, and loved every minute of it. She was also stubborn. I would like to go back and change things with Kira, but that's way, way back. Deep down, though, Kira was a little girl. She expected far too much of life and demanded instant satisfaction. Little girls end badly when they fall in with the wrong crowd. Rough. Hmm. Yeah, there was way back when when I had my little trice with her that uh, probably could have affected that, but not now. Yen is life. Yen is is you know Yen is lore. Just his style. Could have had her hanged, decapitated. Even a burning pyre would have been a quicker death. He wanted to watch her suffer. Before we leave, we have to bury her. I won't let crows pick her rotting flesh off a stake. I can do that much, at least. Guards will hand over the body, given the proper incentive. I really hope we contact Philippa and Rita before they meet a similar fate. Where are they? Know where they are. Yennefer's looking into Rita's whereabouts. I have to figure out where Philippa is. Know what Yen's found out? You'll need to ask her. I've been busy trying to find Philippa. So, learn anything? A few things that could be interesting. Prefer the long version or the short? Tell me everything. I want the details. After fleeing Loch Muin, Philippa ended up here in Novigrad. She sought help from her former lover, the sorcerer Arthur de Vlister. Philippa and a former lover? Something tells me happily ever after is not how that story ends. <laughs> Probably not. Philippa had made a fool of him once. Arthur was out for revenge. He convinced her she'd be safest as an owl. She transformed and he placed a dimeridium band on her leg. The mage hunt started shortly afterwards. Sadly, Arthur fell victim. 
they auctioned off his estate. Just so happened a certain dwarven acquaintance of ours stumbled on the auction. Zoltan. Huh. So Philippa was here under our noses the whole time. She was Zoltan's Why? owl. Precisely. Zoltan lost her in a card game a few days ago. <laughs> Figures. Yep, that's Zoltan for you. A man showed up here, fleeced Zoltan Bear, then proposed they play for the owl. Naturally, he won. Then politely thanked Zoltan for the game and left. Who was it? Know where he lives? He's not from here. No one knows him. Great. We got any leads? We have this. It's a feather. The owl's feather? Thinking divination. Specifically hydromancy and a form of sortilage. We need sortilage. A we won't be of course. Uh, should we just go do that now? Let's uh, meet her later, because I want to talk to everybody else while I'm here. Need to take care of something first. Meet you somewhere later. Fine. The fountain outside the passive floor. And hurry, please. Because everybody's here to talk to. So Tris is cute, and she's a lot lighter spirited than Yen. Yen's a little heavy, but um, Tris kind of did something rotten back in back in the day. I don't know if it was uh, Witcher 1 or Witcher 2, but there was a point when Geralt lost his memory. He, because of all the stuff that happened uh, with Letho, he ended up actually running with the Wild Hunt for like five years um, as some sort of punishment or something, and he lost his memory after that. Um, but he had been with Yen before. While he uh, was suffering from this amnesia, Triss took advantage of him and uh, seduced him then. And so he and her had a thing, but then he got his memory back and realized he was supposed to be with Yennefer. So that's kind of dirty of her to do that. So, you know, uh, you know, I don't not necessarily holding that against her but she's not perfect <laughs> for sure uh, but anyway yen is just such a deeper character and it's where his heart really lies i mean the whole trajectory of the literature is him and yen and just the whole thing and we already did the um the quest where um well if you go back if you go to history he uh when he met yen she was being attacked by a jinn and he did this he had this wish he used his wish to bind him to yen and that saved her because she was bound to him but and they were a thing from then on but she was worried that maybe they didn't really love each other it was just a spell so we went up to this boat on top of a mountain and uh broke the jinn spell um and turns out they still loved each other nothing had changed so they were meant to be together yen is hotter i think so too but <laughs> it's not just about hotness because they're all hot and apparently if you try to romance them both in here um there's a scene where they're all in their laundry and they're tying them up on the bed and they think that uh he, he thinks oh boy this is gonna go well and then they both walk away from him and he gets nothing <laughs> so don't be greedy don't be greedy Try to be a two-timer, you're a no-timer. Okay. So we gotta find Siri and we gotta get it right. Hmm. Maybe I don't to unwind. Oh, is that Siri? All right, so we just need to go do this because it's not giving me any other options. Okay, so we're in blindingly obvious. All right, so we should have just gone with Triss, I guess. Resume. Um, I got to go to the bathroom real quick, guys. Yeah, there's just a better story. It is. It is. I'll be right back. I'm just going to visit the monkey room real quick.
All right, I'm back. Yen cares about him and Siri more. She will do anything for them. Triss won't. I don't know. I mean, except for her duplicity with uh, seducing Geralt, she seems to pretty much have her heart in the right place. Had to put some more clothes on, too. It's cold here. All right, let's go. I guess we're going to the fountain. Triss wines too much. <laughs> She's a little less mature, that's for sure. Yen is just super, like, multi layered and wise and smart and just has an older soul, I guess. Yen, Triss, what about this Gwent everyone is always talking about? <laughs> she must be pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, Gwent is my true love. She's tricky, and she likes to play games. But, uh... We know how to play the game better than her. I think the past like, Flora is a horror house. Up here. If I remember correctly. The eternal flame will burn away our sins. I could go for some dumplings. Should we visit that first? <clears throat> Speaking of trice, where are we going? His Majesty this way. Radovid is a stern is ruler. You captured that room. That's what you want Sure you weren't followed? Yeah. Let's begin. Observe the water's surface carefully. We can't let anything go unnoticed. Graham, et weir, Robert. That's the best one in all of Novigrad. <laughs> Graham, et weir, Diagnis, Kerle, es Pirschena, a es Kleis. Looks familiar. A bathhouse. I know the place. Dijkstra. Okay, so this is where we get back in with Dijkstra. I guessed as much. Was that the past or the future? Was that the past or the future? The recent past. We have to hurry. All right. Raymat says, uh, I think I remember at some point Yen abandoning all morals to help them, but Triss sided with the Lodge for her position in the books. For her position in the books. Maybe. I didn't read them all. Um, but yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go to the bathhouse. Might not be too late. Come on. Come on. And nobody will know you now. She's strong, man. She pushed me around. I hope we get there in time. I hope Dijkstra hasn't already hurt her. The possibilities are many. Could be Dijkstra that got hurt. Not likely. Dijkstra never forgave her for sending assassins after him. And Philip is weakened, no doubt about it. Weakened, maybe, but still a powerful sorceress. If Dijkstra's men take the Dimeridium off, Philip will kill them before they can say, oh shit. <laughs> Don't you fear the pyre, freak? We've had many other quests over here in this bathhouse. Yeah, Mr. Manga, Common. You don't, you seem well. Speaking of knowing how to win in a game with Yen, let her win. Yeah. Whoa, what was that? Guess they underestimated Philippa. You were right. She must have changed back into human. Quick! Explosions. I sense strong magic. We have to get inside. Surrender! 
Oh! <laughs> this place is a maze, witch! You'll never get out! God there she is. Fools! After her! Evil Radovid had her eyes gouged out. We'll handle this. Oh no! no she does no. all right. The sorceress stays here. Uh, Triss goes with me. We're going together. Not a chance. It's fine, Geralt. I'll stay in case she tries to flee this way. Fine. Be right back. Okay. What? Damn, she cast a spell on the witch. Oh, we gotta kill these guys. Not a problem. Can I lose him? Just that burned one. All right, where is she? It was one of these that had like a secret passage, yeah. I remember this. She doesn't, uh, she doesn't come willingly. Oh, there's a troll down here. I am your master now. You're to protect me, understood? Bark, stand under. Stand here. And let no one pass. Bark, here, and pass. Not too late to surrender. Okay. I thought I could break it. So apparently she was having the uh, troll protect her. Bart! I spared Bart's life once already. Catch her. So Bart? We shall no past go. No past go. No collect two hundred dollars. Damn it! Cast a spell on him too. I want to help her. Oh, lost focus. She's hurt. Did you see that? I want to help her. Birdy, no past go. Say, but no let past go. Ever had a stomach ache? I but once old drowner eat. Her stomach aches like she just ate a hundred old drowners. But no want drowner make egg very bad. Let me pass. I can help her. But let past go. Which help? <laughs> Yay! We don't have to hurt him. That way's locked. Bark, let us help go. You. Help me die. Don't hold your breath. Goodies everywhere. Mm -hmm. All right, let's not worry about it. Oh, gosh. Trolls are so cute. I love how they talk. She's got a tummy ache, Bart. I gotta help her with her tummy ache. Okay. I'm not out to hurt you. Bollocks! Uh, 
All right, I think I remember what happens here. There is a, um, a whatchamacallit, a a golem. There's a golem here. Golems, you got to use elemental oil. So let's do that. And there's going to be a bunch of fire, too. She's going to try to burn me up. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And I don't know what's good against him. Uh, maybe... I think Earden slows them down. I want to help you. Ha! Forgive me, but I just don't believe you. Yeah, fire elemental. Okay, that's different. Uh, what did I just put on there? I think I might have put the right thing still. Yeah, a fire ele elemental. Elemental oil. Art. Oh, okay. Art puts out the fire. Gotta sneak up on her. Let's put the lock on. Drink some swallow. Put that away. Can we jump this? Oh, we can't. Wait, we break for loot. How do we get up there? Ouch. Okay, stop it, man. Is there a way to climb? You do not deserve to live. I don't see it. Under here we're safe. What's up, Surly? How are you? Maybe we can jump this if I get out of the water. I can see where she's going to shoot. There we go. I'll hit the chains. Your chat text is not showing. I can see you. Stop squirming. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be long dead by now. Oh. What do you want? To torment me? To watch others do so? I need you romance help. Philippa? No. She's a little traumatized. PTSD. Betray me, and I will relax. Not planning on it. Triss is outside. She'll explain everything. Okay. Remember that taking me a lot more tries. 
before. Deepest apologies, but the lady will come with me. Deedstra, I don't have time for this. Get out of my way. I've no quarrel with you, Geralt, but Phil and I have lots to talk about. Remember the assassins you sent after me, darling Phil? A grave error. Such matters ought to be handled personally, as I will now demonstrate. Um... I need her. Not gonna demonstrate a damn thing. I need her. And I don't give a flying fuck. I've awaited this moment forever, so very sorry, but I care as much about your plans as I do about the snows of Mahakam. Philippa will come with me and answer for all the courtesies she's paid me. Oh, I think this is what we're supposed to do here. I'll tell you what the Emperor's after if you let us go. Always knew the value of information, Dijkstra. Which is why I don't believe you have anything I don't already know. The Emperor of Nilfgaard wasn't able to sway the Trade Corporation. Opposition nibbling at his ass, eh? Hmm. Seems the White Flame won't dance on the graves of his foes much longer. His daughter has returned. The Emperor wants to abdicate, give her the throne. Cyrilla? Impossible. This... this could shift the tide of war. Provided, of course, you're not mistaken. Emperor himself told me. So, information's first hand. Emir's a lying whore. When it comes to his daughter's future, doubt it. You've no idea of the importance of this information. A change on the Imperial we should have made a deal first. could bring the war to an end. Radovid's sure to be delighted. If Amir sounds the retreat, there'll be no force left that could possibly stop that madman. Especially in light of our bloody aborted plan. You didn't actually believe you could do it. Radovid's crazy, but he's no idiot. Knows all too well there are dozens out there who... Silence. Do I understand you correctly? You want to kill Radovid? <laughs> well, Siggy, I am impressed. Siggy. Doubted you still had it in you, frankly. Sadly, as you well know, Radovid has sought refuge on his boat. He's guarded so closely, I'd not be at all surprised to learn he shares his bed each night with two sentries. You know too much, Phil. Yet one more reason why you must die. I think you might want to hear her out. I dare say Philippa despises Radovid at least as much as you do. I'm content someone apart from myself has finally gotten the idea to rid the world of the degenerate. Save your praise for others. I couldn't give a shit. Currently, only two individuals stand to draw Radovid off his boat. Emir and myself. You'd agree to be the bait? I fear you'd be hard-pressed to convince Emir to dangle himself as such. Fat fucking chance. Geralt, I wouldn't trust this cunt to hard-boil my eggs. Easy there, Rightly man. Rightly so. I'm terrible with eggs. But think on this. Radovid hears that you've captured me. Will he not throw caution to the wind? Will he not jump at the chance to kill me, personally, with his bare hands? Out of the question. Geralt, get her out of here before I burst her testicle. Oh my. <laughs> and then, <clears throat> then we must meet with our friends. I've leased a warehouse port side. Be sure to come. Okay. We missed a chance to break his leg there. Um, but this part was Sorry important. Sorry to take so long, but I had to deal with the guards. Hello, Triss. Philip, are you all right? I've been better. I'll get you out of here. Meet me at night in the main square. We have to take care of Kira. See you then. Okay. That was relatively painless. All right, we gotta meet Triss on the main square at midnight. So let's find our way back out of here. I think it, this way. Quest completed. Blindingly obvious. We could collect on fiber. 
All right, let's go out to the main square. Meditate till midnight. I guess it's not letting me um, do the other people yet. It's one at a time. Down it, lost my way again. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So while I got the performance decent in Novigrad, you can still feel it. It hits the hardest, but it's not unplayable. How's my weight? I'm still fine. We won't worry about Merchant now. Where am I supposed to meet her? Out uh, here? No, behind me. Over here somewhere. Oh, there she is. Not just yet. We should wait until nightfall. Okay. Midnight, right? Meow. Okay. Oh, you're here. Finally. What do we do? <laughs> Been You've here. got to approach the That's guards. I, they could recognize me. I'd rather not show my face. They could recognize right. me. You stay here. Alright, get rid of the guards. Now, this is something you haven't seen. Looks like rain. Oh my. What was her crime? Is that Kira? Same as all of them. Witchcraft and fornication with succubi. Cunt tried to seduce Radovid, but he saw through her. Showed her what we do to traitors. Hey, Bechamel. Yeah, let's use a little axiom. Take your friend and go for a walk. Perhaps we've earned a break. Hi. 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 Time. How you doing, Bishamel? I'll take her somewhere safe. You want help? Sure you don't need any help? Don't trouble yourself. See ya. Aw. Poor Kira. If I ever play through again, I'll try to figure out how to make that go differently. That's a sad moment. All was all was good. I had a little space in my gaming schedule, and uh, they did this uh, graphics upgrade to The Witcher Three. So I thought we'd go back and do the um, the DLCs, but. First, I decided to go back and get the better ending, which is what we're working on now. All right, so we got to talk to Avala and talk to Yennefer in the daylight, apparently. If you wouldn't have given her the paper she wanted, you could have had her fight at the fort with you and fight on this. Yeah, I knew it was back there at that fort. So, I didn't know. Next time, I will never give it to her. Um, let's, uh, let's do Siri first, because um, she's the one I'm most anxious about getting right. So, she's up there. So, let's go check her out. And uh, I'm actually going to do a little quick save right here. Just in case I get it wrong. <laughs> we'll probably get a timer on a decision with her. Oh. 
Is that her? There she is. Can't mistake Siri. Looking for something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? When I was last in Novigrad, I had my share of troubles. So I heard. A few people helped me then. Others, not so much. Now I mean to repay them both. Coming with? Sure, let's go. Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. Oh my. He's dead. A bit late for that. He's dead. I asked Sultan. And he said Horson's alive and well on Temple Isle. I was there. Stuck a sword in his gut. Your hand must have slipped. Because it seems he's recovered. Okay. Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? I don't know. Depends what I see. Oh. Again. Oh. I your pardon. Yeah, I killed him. He was a jerk. The rain will cleanse the city streets. Yeah, so we can fix the ending with Siri, but the part with Kira was way too far back. Oh. This is already a good amount of work redoing all this bit, but Siri's worth it. Oh, oh, oh. What? Here to see Mr. Wiley. Mr. Wiley's expecting important guests, so bugger off, you... you... Chance! <laughs> we'll figure something out. You like how Siri can walk through people, but everyone else gets so annoyed when you walk into them? Yeah. Make a deal, maybe? Uh... Yeah. Yeah. A deal. Go on upstairs. Boss is waiting. Nice. That was Axie is so useful. Strange. To say the least. I wonder what they're doing. We'll know soon enough. Nice purple pants. Uh, well, who do we have here? Finally found your little ward. Took your sweet fucking time. Seems in fine health to me. Ah, because you thought you killed me that time. Surprise the fucking prize. Shut your trap, witch. Before somebody fills that hole for you. Enough. I'll finish what you started. Whoa, whoa, stop. It's me, Dudu. Dudu Bieberfeld. You really didn't recognize me. Did you? Prove it. Wait, Siri. After the heist, after Dijkstra's vault was emptied, you vanished. How'd I find you? Quick. Butcher's yard, the mama's plate, Priscilla's. You dragged me onto the stage. Sheathe your sword, Siri. It's Doodoo. God! <laughs> Doodoo's a mimic. Quite the scare. That was a stupid joke, or... Yeah. Not wise to play games with a witcher. Horson Jr.? Was there no one else you could impersonate? Once we'd fled, I'd no idea what to do. I could only hide for so long. They'd find me sooner or later. It wasn't our decision. We knew he was dead, but not many others had caught on. That was my chance. No one mourned for Horson Jr. In all his miserable life, he'd never helped a soul. Amusingly, once dead, he became a useful member of society. They say everyone deserves a second chance. Seems true enough. Orson got his, in a way, sharing it with a Doppler named Doodoo. Doppler, not Mimic. Hope you guys heard that. 
Good thing I've got that the uh, captions on at least. I'd never expect it from you. Neither the volume I. oscillates a lot. Oh, by the way, you've no idea at the relief I feel you're alive and well. And I'm relieved I didn't slit your throat. How's business? Chose an interesting line of business. Dudu's always had a head for numbers. What's a few brothels and casinos? He'll manage. That's the thing. I don't need to. Two weeks after Wiley died, I announced I'd seen the light of the eternal fire. Sold all the illegal enterprises. I'm a blue water trader now. Horson's men didn't protest. I've contacts in the guilds. Run a thriving trade. Profits are twice what they were before. To Wiley's men, a purse twice as heavy means twice as much respect for the men handing it to them. Be careful. You could get found out. Wiley's men are too stupid to catch on. His colleagues ain't much better. Mind you, even you were fooled. And that might have ended very badly for you. True. I get a bit carried away at times. But mostly I'm careful. Do I rate Witcher 3 as a must-play game for everyone? Um, well, there's no game that everyone must play because everyone's different, right? I think it's a really good one. I've had my my little issues with it, but, you know, as far as it goes, I think it is a really good open-world RPG. Um, one of the better ones. I think it's the writing really stands out and just the touches and the quests and everything. I've never really been much of one for lots of cutscenes, but I don't mind these, actually, because... They're good. Um, they're not just dumb. Like, we're going to play Starfield when it comes out, and I'm going to hate the cutscenes in that. <laughs> just from what I've seen, the characters are so lifeless and glassy-eyed, and um, these these are really interesting. And the combat's okay. Um, I like it now in the next-gen one that we're closer. Um, but yeah, it's a really good game. If, if it's a long game, if you've got 100 hours, it's awesome. <laughs> so if, if people are into open world RPGs, this is definitely one they should play. If they're not into that, then probably not. Um, especially at the current price, it's really good if you like this kind of game. Yeah, super cheap now. I think I picked up this and the DLCs for like 15 bucks or something like that. So very good value for the dollar, for sure. And I, I like the characters, I like the story. I think they did really, really well with it. Um, you know, it definitely is showing its age a little bit. It's definitely this next gen upgrade has helped. Um, but you can see it's still, animations can be a little janky, you know, but uh, it's good. It's definitely a quality game. If it wasn't, I certainly wouldn't be playing it. Well, I can't say everybody needs to play it, but uh, I definitely wanted to. Time I came up. back to it. Right. We must still go by the Golden Sturgeon. It was nice to see you both. And take care of yourselves. You too. So long, Dudu. The voice acting is excellent. Why are we going to the Sturgeon? To see a girl who helped me once. Who might that be? Friends of Dandelions. Her name's Bee. She's a waitress at the Golden Sturgeon. Helped me contact Dandelion. I wish to thank her. She risked a lot. Risked a lot? How's that? The temple guard were breathing down my neck. If she'd been seen with me, she might have been flogged or worse. Always getting into trouble. I take after you. Oh. Yeah, if you hang out, it, it's on sale all the time. They might have gone up a little nice bit just because of the next gen thing, but it's still on sale now. I visited not a city super, once that was very sale. much like Novigrad, but the people there were much taller and had dark skin. This somewhere in Zeracania? No, in another world. Hmm. What's it like, hopping between worlds? Anything like passing through a portal? Or different? One second, guys. Mm, a bit different. It was hard going at first. I wasn't very good at controlling it, so I had to concentrate intensely. And hope I didn't land in the crater of an active volcano. The training I did with Avalark was very helpful. Now, I merely think of the place I wish to travel to, close my eyes, and it's done. How about that? My son was going out. 
They must be ordered. You got the fancy edition with the DLCs for 12 bucks? Wow. Your kind spreads disease, defeatism, and desertion. Do you know Mr. Menga? You don't, you've seen well. I would definitely say for this kind of open world RPG, I don't know if anyone's done much better. That's for sure. And most of the ones I've seen since then, the quality's gone down. CD Projekt Red is kind of a hero of the gamers until they got so disappointed with the Cyberpunk release. But Cyberpunk actually is, I think, an equally good game. And there's some things about it that are a lot better. It runs better, <laughs> for sure. But Cyberpunk's a lot more grim. There's grim stuff in here, but it's not totally depressing. Any needs, Master? Where are we going? Only comparable one you can think of is maybe Skyrim. Yeah, and Skyrim is way more dated. And the dialogue's not nearly as good. Give you a chance. Should have taken him. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, you cow. Mind your manners. You're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. <laughs> These kind of seem like they go together. Leave on your own. Sure it is. You're a fucking freak too. He is. Very dangerous at that. The butcher of White Orchard. What'd he do there? Trim the trees? Yugen. He slew half the village. Dragged the bodies of the alderman and his wife behind his horse to Novigrad. Let's get out of here. That's pretty good advice your friend's offering. S -s Sorry. <laughs> that went well. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, the story is excellent. I say more determined this time. Shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. Now, you gotta be into games with story, because the story is very strong. Who's your charming companion? But you get, uh... You get plenty of time to um, run around and do open world things too. I'm mainly plowing through story primarily right now because I'm trying to finish the ending with the better ending than I got last time concerning her, Siri. Geralt of Rivia. <gasps> that Geralt! <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Very I've nice heard so to meet much. you. Siri, didn't you have something to take care of? Right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop. Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh, my. It's beautiful. Thank you. So, Will you stay for stew? And keep slaughtered the piglet this morning. Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. Ah, off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both. I do take care of our witcher. I will. So long. Bravo, witcher. I've material for another ballad. <laughs> okay. <sighs> So, your friend, B. What about her? Nothing. Seems nice. Geralt. You're terrible. What'd I say? <laughs> what I say? What's there to see in far corners? The camp of some traveling circus performers. Non-humans. When I came here before, I wanted to contact Triss. Life was hard. I quickly spent nearly everything the Baron gave me. Triss and I never met, because the temple guard showed up. 
I was a wanted woman afterwards. Triss didn't try to contact you? How could she? She didn't know anything. In fact, she thought she was to meet another alchemist wanting to flee Novigrad. I preferred not to put her in danger. I was being hunted. Had not a copper to my name. Then I met Valda. He and his troop helped me. Then introduced me to B. And through B, I found Dandelion. You know the rest. I wonder how B knew Dandelion. <clears throat> Uh, do you know anything of this, really? Have you played it? Or apparently you haven't played it. But... There! Baldo! Siri, you devil incarnate, where have you been? Come here, darling. Hello? What's this? Brought your granddad? <laughs> Agar, you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. Likewise, and thanks for helping Siri. Oh, we had no choice. Found it hard to refuse a lass like her. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. We'd have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Better start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses. And another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so not to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our nags for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. Mm, maybe we can help. Hmm. Anyway, we can help. Oh, don't fret about us. We always get by somehow. Right, Siri? What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri, you know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. Hmm. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? Why not? Gladly. A man after my own spirit. Sounds like we're going to have a horse race. <laughs> Come. Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. I've got a roach. Happy trails. Apparently not. Run, oh. Roach. Go go. Go go. You were faster once. Giving you a head start. Okay, now I gotta figure out where to go. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Master, you're trailing. Watch where you're going, or you'll fall. <laughs> Seems you've slowed. Just want to admire you from the side. Once there was a little problem. No problem. Me and Roach. In Cyberpunk, they've Can put in a little you. Roach I'm arcade game. Win. Lovely race. Well, this calls for a celebration. Stay the evening. Cute. We've several barrels of Kedwin's best. Bonfires to be lit soon, round which all will gather. This night shall be ours. And apparently they have added a roach card to Gwent as well. He's on a roof, which is pretty funny. The birds you know, in that field were real weird. Perhaps it's not my concern, but I'm glad you and Yennefer have ended up together. Me too. You took your time. <laughs> Guess we both needed a while to grapple with it. So, what was it like? You know, when the wish lost its hold? What did you feel? Hmm. Well, there we were, the two of us, on the mountaintop. I looked at her and... 
and felt like I was exactly where I was supposed to be at long last. Aww. That's why it's Yen for More life. Wine. Thanks. I'm glad we stayed. Me too. They like you here. I like them too. Oh, I'd love to join them. Drink and race, travel from town to town. Not worry a whit about anything. All right, I think we're free for any one of these. Good plan. I think I'll go with you. Then our future's settled. If that is, there's more than ash left of us once this is over. Defeating the hunt won't be easy, but with the Lodge's support, Avalax, we can do this. I fear fighting the hunt will only be the beginning, for me at least. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> you promised! <laughs> In jest? Sometimes I wish I could be like them. Drunk? <laughs> Drunk or giggling. Whichever it is, today's your chance. <laughs> Not what I meant. I'd like to be ordinary. Hmm. One's the true one. The problem is, you're not. You were born to greatness. As I've been hearing since I was born. All because of this damned elder blood. My gift. My curse. It granted me all of these powers, but it's also why I've spent my life fleeing, hiding. Then it's time to end this. Once we defeat Eredin, you'll be free. Really? Eredin's hardly alone. There are others. They have plans for me. It was the sorceresses of the Lodge once. Now it's my father. Even Yennefer. You're forgetting Avalar. Avalar's different. He is intent on my gift not falling into the wrong hands. Not spinning out of control. It's why he teaches me, protects me. If you say so. You doubt it? There'll come a day when Avalok will ask you for a favor. Perhaps. But if so, it will be a very, very long time from now. And I'm certain whatever it is, he'll give me a choice. I will have the option to refuse. Hope you're right. That's Pablo. I plan to learn how to juggle one day. Incredibly useful skill. <laughs> Finally found you two. Enjoying yourselves. I'd rather know how you fared with the merchant. Managed to get some horses. Pah, lost cause. The man refused to trade. I said I'd buy. He asked three arms and a host of legs for one healthy animal. We need horses. But we'll have to find another way to get them. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. I knew you'd warm to the notion. We mean to sneak into the man's stable. With 30 head, a few more or less won't make a difference in his life. Coming with? Of course. Um... I can buy him. Gotta be another way to solve this. It just so happens I got some coin I could lend you. We'd have no way to repay you. Wouldn't have to. A generous offer, but not one to resolve this situation. The merchant didn't object to our coin. He objected to us. I'll not trade with such scum. Believe those were his words. And if he'll not trade, we've no choice but to steal from him. Well, you convinced me then. Uh, what can I do? Gotta help those in need. Yes, yes, yes! Little horse wrestling? Say, you didn't seem the type to me. What type? Steady. Time to go. We'll meet by the stables. I didn't seem steady. What? That was a dig.
Oh yeah, no one will recognize me with that. <laughs> ah. hey, Keep a lookout. All right, gotta sneak into the stables. All right. Uh, I'll follow Siri. And I got a little stitch in my side happening. One sec. Geralt? I gotta find a way in. Uh, sneaking in. Locked. Gotta find another way in. Loot. <laughs> Alright, how do we get in here? There might be a way into this building somewhere. But it's actually over here. Where the circle is. Side, to open the stable doors using your Witcher senses. These ones, right? Is that guy asleep? Save there in case I mess up. Uh, I mean, I could just ard them open, but I somehow I doubt that's what I'm meant to do. All right, instead of jumping, let's go down the ladder. That guy's snoozing. supposed to convince the horses somehow? I could axie the horses and have them stampede, but that's not very stealth. There's got to be something uh, more subtle. Oh, here we go. Keys. Huh, here's the key. Oh, it wants me to do it back here. All right. Fine. Guy's a heavy sleeper. That's cool. As long as I didn't have to kill nobody. Woohoo! We did it! Excellent work! Did you see the two fools who tried to chase us? Almost tripped over their own boots. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. That was splendid. Yeah, a nice change from killing monsters. Thanks for your help, and for visiting. It was so good to see you all again. 
Hang in there and take care of yourselves. I learned to get the good ending. It's not. So long. It's not a good idea to be moralistic. I must bid Valdo farewell. All right. See you at Dandelions then. Got some things to take care of in town. See you, Geralt. It's more about trusting her Happy than about God. moralizing. All right. So I didn't see anything. Uh, we didn't get any of those linchpin decisions with her, the time decisions, but um, we did do what she wanted. So look at this one. That was good. Let's go talk to Avalach and and uh, Yennefer now. now. Here's one of these things. Oop. That sharpens my blades. Fire. Trouble? That's no good. Looking to make some coin turn, hey. Right, let me just check something real quick here. Okay. Just want to make sure I get this right. All right, Yen and Avila. Sub Zoltan. Zoltan. Get up. Novigrad doesn't seem like a safe place anymore. What's keeping you here? I was keen on starting my own enterprise. Nothing came of it. Nevertheless, I took on some debt. Don't you pay it back now? I'd like to blame it on the war or human treachery, but the truth is, I've got my own thick skull to blame. Rather not dwell on it, get out, if you don't mind. Okay. Nice talking to you, Zoltan. See you later. Uh, let's see. Master volume's all the way up. The voices seem a little low sometimes. Home cinema. Oh, here we go. Headphones. That's what we gotta do. We'll turn the music down a wee bit. And let's see if that's a better balance. How much? Ooh, that's a lot louder. Where are we going? Where are we going? Is this the Ruby Suite? Guess we'll talk to Avalok first. Need a hanky? Gotta admit, never expected this of you. Oh my. You humans have... Hmm, unusual tastes. How did you fare on Bald Mountain? Need to ask? You're a sage. I ask as a courtesy. A concept you clearly forgot when you left without uttering a word. Siri was in a hurry. I know, so she wrote in her letter. But that is not my concern. You eliminated Imlareth adeptly. So adeptly you might say you inspired me. And what do you got in mind? Meaning? The loss of one of his great generals has weakened Eredin significantly. Two others remain. 
How do we get rid of them? Caranthia is a loyalist, but Gels, that is another story. He was a devoted follower of our former king. The music's got to go down a little bit more. Let's try that. And as it happens, Eredin poisoned our beloved ruler. Hmm. Regicide. Serious stuff. Take it not many know about this. Of the living? Only I. And Eredin, of course. Question is, so er Eredin poisoned their Nothing ruler. Nothing you need worry about. These elves, high elves. Haven't mentioned killing gels. Such drastic means are not always necessary. So you probably plan to offer him a deal. Brilliant deduction. Bravo. Fine. So what do you propose? Why to bring Gels here? Show him the truth of what happened. Fabulous plan. If we only knew where to find him. We do. In the land of the NL. NL. Land of the NL? He would know. You don't recall. After all, you did travel with Eredin for some time. The land of the Elder Folk. The world where we arrived centuries ago. I just the world did that one for our benefit. The Red Riders come from there. And it is there where we will find Gels. Land of the Alder Folk. Think you're forgetting something. You and Siri might know how to travel between worlds. But me? Not so much. You clearly know there are many other worlds apart from the one where we now stand. They're linked by passages, hidden gateways that afford travel from one world to another. Yeah, the world of the Witcher of is course, actually a big multiverse you know of, of these sorts. Gateways, even fewer can locate them. Elven sages, for example? For example. One such passage will open soon near where we are, fortuitously enough. Between this noble edifice and the butcher's yard. That's our chance. Shall we go? Let's go. I vaguely remember this one. This one gets real trippy. I know this house. Supposed to drive a godling from here. Supposed to? Decided it was harmless. This lady, Corinne Tilly. Yes. Yeah, that was a whole thing. All right, where'd dude go? Did I go the wrong way? I think I might have, unless he's up there. Yeah, I think I took a wrong turn at Albuquerque. All right, let's go back. Nice purple. Where'd he go? The passage uh -huh. is here, past okay. this wall. <laughs> there it is. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay. How's that? This is the place. Purple spiderweb glitch is cool. Yeah, I think uh because I was enter, using my Witcher there'll senses. There'll be no returning until we reach Gels. Ready? Yes, let's go. Remember, wherever you land. Search for a place that looks like this one. We shall meet sooner or later. Mean we'll be separated? It's possible. 
I lack your ward's talent. Zirel is the lady of time and space. I merely know how to use this arcane knowledge to a limited degree. Okay, a little, a little humility. Amazing. I hate portals. <laughs> that's, that's a classic line of his. You okay, buddy? Oh, I didn't do that. I meant to do that. Where are we? Welcome to the Diderwet Desert. There's somewhere in our world. Ever seen such canyons in your world? Come, you must go. What is this run. place? A very old world, thoroughly raped and destroyed. Anything live here? Mainly desert creatures, able to survive months on end without water. Oh, and large sand crabs beneath the surface. We must be careful they don't sense us. And before, were there any people or elves? Do you believe humanoids have a monopoly on destroying worlds? So what oh, did live here? Sentient monsters of some sort? Look at those cliffs. Remind you of anything? Hmm. Look a bit like the bed of a giant river. Or the bottom of a sea. Mean there were water creatures here once? No creatures. Merely a sea. Trying to say that... That there are many different worlds and even more forms of life. Many of them intelligent, much more so, in fact, than you humans. But as it turns out, not even that could stop them from exhausting all the resources of their world. To the last drop. Ah, the portal. Looks more like a ruin. Appearances can be deceiving. So what are we waiting for? For it to open. Shouldn't take but a few moments. What's going on? The sand crabs have sensed our presence. Wonderful. <sighs> yeah, a little sand crab fight. As soon as the portal opens, jump in after me! You don't hurt me. Three, two, one. Very good. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, what a relief. <laughs> All right. Have a look. Another one. You got separated. So we gotta find the next passage. This is clearly the roadway here. There's that. Okay, that's it there, so. Yes. In case we were there wondering. It is. Gotta get there. Vapors don't look terribly inviting. No, they don't. Okay. Gotta hold my breath. Any longer and I'd have suffocated. Alright. <coughs> I wonder if I could call Roach here. <laughs> Somehow I expect not. A 
medallion's humming. Ooh, place, place of, of power. power. It's gotta be. You know, I don't think I held it long enough at the previous one. one before uh, we kill the general. Eat some water. And uh, let's do a swallow. We gotta get up there. Armor there. Cold. Cold. Remember, this place is the one so cold that kills you. I gotta you. find that next passage quick. Okay. Let's get all healed up. This is where we might die. I don't know if we have any protection against cold. Hmm. We just took a swallow. I want to get my health to full. Obviously, we have to run for the light there. Not healing pretty, very fast. All right. Let's see what happens. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't think we're going to make it all the way there. Crap. Right, here's the house. Don't die. Get inside. Oh, no. Oh, first death. All right. Hopefully we're not too far back. Should have done a save. Yeah. Cold. So there's gotta be something closer. I wonder where we're supposed to go. Let's not waste any time though. Freeze to death if I don't hide somewhere. And I gotta find that next passage quick. Something here? No. There's a house here. Whew. Okay. I'm trying to get all the mats because we're gonna need them for our armor. It's down here. Certain grouchy elven sage. 
All right, let's go. Snow's up to the rooftops. Wonder how long this blizzard's been blowing. Well, this might be helpful right now. Of course. Oh, what else? Are you stuck out there, buddy? Salute their guts. All right. Warmed by the fire, hopefully. Go. Might as well loot the place. Alright. Let's go. Took you a while? Did you run into trouble? Just a little cold. Mm, no. Just taking in the sights. What is this place? Feels like I've been here before. You have. You fought Eridan's projection here. Before that, Siri fought here. For you. What are you talking about? Ever wondered how you managed to leave the Red Riders? Many times, but I don't remember a thing. Siri came for you. She sensed you were in danger, tore you from the hunt's grasp, then deposited you in the woods near Kaer Morhen. Siri. Did Aridan start hunting her because of that? Because of me? Why didn't she say anything? <sighs> what would it have changed? Hold on, guys. I gotta see if something's open. It's cold here today. I need another layer. Got four layers on now. Cut the heater on, but I turned it on kind of late. All right. Uh, let's ask a few questions. Where are we? World of the NL? No. This is Ted Dara, the time of the end. The world destroyed by the White Frost. Alas, this awaits us all, though at differing stages of our existence. So calm when you say that. Eridan succumbed to his knowledge of the Apocalypse. Fear rules him now. I'll not commit the same error. Care to clarify? Not here. Not now. So the White Frost is important, and uh, we'll see why later. That's also why uh, the wild hunt is so cold when they come. Going after Gels is proving quite a trek, but I still don't know why it's so important. Eridan differs from the king he killed. 
power for its own sake interests him. He has little patience for bureaucracy. He spends most of his time atop his steed, leading the Red Riders. So what does he need in the capital? A good viceroy. Gels is an excellent administrator and an even better plotter. He's the most dangerous individual amongst the NL. He got any weaknesses? Yes. He's righteous. I was hoping we wouldn't get separated. I warned you it could happen. Where'd your journey take you? Through a world whose son had just died. I barely reached the next passage in time. Light on the peak. Was that you? I thought it might aid your passage. After all, that is what lighthouses do. Show the way. Alright, let's go. Doesn't look safe here either. Let's go. This way. Next passage. When will it open? Shortly. Alright. Tirin Ali, Viceroy Gale's Palace. At last, this Tirin the Palace of Awakening. Tirin Palace. Gale's headquarters. I wonder if we can change the time. Nope. Cannot meditate here. <sighs> Beautiful. I'm glad to know you appreciate it. Elven architecture is a bit more sophisticated than yours. <laughs> so hotty. Talk to Gels. Oh, yep. who's this? And why are they here? I believe we're done for the day, my tulip. Be a dear and leave us alone. For I think we can agree this matter is between us and us alone, correct? Crivana, Spain, at Coman Maca, and the Witcher of Rivia. Ketmil. Do you like my new model? Something of Lara Doran about her, wouldn't you agree, Crivan? Her height, perhaps. Nothing more. <laughs> I see I've touched a tender spot. So let's change the subject, shall we? Care for a drink? Yeah, not in the mood. Didn't come here for tea. Hmm. I must admit, you appearing here. Quite the surprise, Witcher. Incidentally, interesting choice of allies. Do you think Avalach is honest with you? Just curious. Uh... It's probably, it's probably two. No, but honesty is not a facet of your species. So quit spewing bile, won't gain you anything. I detect a shadow of impatience in your faces, it seems. So what brings you here? I've come to tell you who killed our king. You've gone through a great deal of trouble to reach me. So I must believe you've put equal effort into preparing this lie. You shall see the truth. You will dream it. You've been a neuromancer. My intuition was correct. This will be interesting. Better believe it. This way, please. Witcher Geralt. A true man of action. Might I know where we're going? To the world of the Enshe. Directly this time. Let's go, before any guards show up. <laughs> He's a Picasso.
stunning likeness. Spruce up the vineyard. Anna Henrietta gives you. <coughs> I want to. That's a DLC thing. I take it I needn't introduce our guest. Greetings, Cyril. So it's true. The swallow has befriended the fox. There's naught you can do to make us turn on one another. Havalach blackmailed you. Do you not remember? Tried to force you to warm our king's bed. Treated your body like a side of pork. I remember. But I also remember what you advise Eredin do with me once I was caught. And I remember what the Red Riders did at Kaer Morhen. I didn't come here to argue. The proof you promised. Where is it? You will see it. In your dream. Ah, yes. The Oneiromancer. Visions that cannot be fabricated. Do you wish to show me how Eredin murdered our king? What then? Am I to incite the NL against Eredin? Call for revolution? And proclaim Avalach our new king? Hmm, we want one. Two is true. Don't flatter yourself. Defy Aridin. That's all you need to do. Very well. Have your oracle summon dreams of my king's last moments. We shall all dream them, to make certain there are no misunderstandings. Why not? Why not? He's so formidable. Face him on your terms, in this world, in a place of your choosing. It's your only chance. Sail to Skellige and find the Sunstone. With it, you will summon the Nargofair. Eredin will come too. Should he call for reinforcements, no NL will answer. You have done the thing most just. A new portal to Tien Aliar will open. I shall stabilize it and you will return. Come with me. Well, that was quite a change of heart of him. He was moved. You know, the models aren't super complicated yet. Just as well. Could have been bluffing. Might they do so much with expressions. Damn it. We should have pressed him. Calm down. Avalok knows him better. We'll hear him out when he returns. Speak of the devil. Geralt's worried. He believes we let girls go too easily. Got off cheap and easy. Sold us a few pieces of advice, some story about a sunstone. He gave us his assurance that he'll not support Eredin. And that is quite a lot. Seems to me you have a plan. Care to share it with us? Once we find the sunstone, aided by your sorceresses and their magic, we shall draw Eredin's ship to a bay along the coast of Undvik. We will wait in ambush, lay a trap, 
When the King of the Hunt arrives, we will spring it and kill him. Just like that? Defeating Eredin will be no small feat, but we will accomplish it. Find the sorceresses at the lodge, and we'll meet at the port. Then we sail to Skellige. So we're getting very close to the end. Let's see if we can do it tonight. We've only been going four hours. I have not been speedrunning yet. Level 32! I think it was level 34 we had to do to use that armor. Alright, we gotta find Yennefer. Is she here? No, she's over here. Okay. Let's make it uh, daytime, eh? Well, here you complained about a long Witcher stream. <laughs> yeah, and we're gonna get the ending right, and then we're gonna do the DLCs. Not tonight, of course, but my goal tonight is to see if we can fix the ending. My wife's mum's an old succubus. Which I think we're on on track. There we go. I can't get anywhere without my little white dots. Strumpet. There is in this quest, though, a um, important point with Siri. And I think it's going to be with Yennefer. I'm not exactly sure. But we have to trust her, is the crux of it. Just what's a whore do exactly? Well, my dad told me to do the laundry. You're a vulgar one. You can see it in your face. Hey there, handsome. Ah. Uh, I don't think that. Oh, she's standing on that. Okay. She's just a little, a little bit off. Be careful there. Where is she? Does she have a room here or something? What's this? Loot. Water. We're actually passing a lot of possible looting. Okay, it's down. Let's do a little bit more. <laughs> Cow's milk. She who knows. She who knows. Uh, let's actually... We've read... Okay. Can I read it now? Dang it. Um, she who knows actually was pretty significant. That was the spirit that we had to decide whether or not to free from under the oak when the um, crones gave us that task. Uh, before they uh, would tell us where Siri went. And w what we did had an effect on whether the Baron's wife got to live, and whether the orphans that the crones had got to live, or whether all the kids in this other town lived. It was a pretty nasty choice, honestly. Um, and... Let's just look at this real quick. All right, this is a lot to read. Well, it's not that much, it's two pages, but uh, I'm just gonna do this and this so you guys can save them if you want and read that. And then I'm gonna read it later. One of two. Oh, and there's another one we didn't read. Letter with Yennefer's instructions. What is this? Dear, my dear friend, I had a feeling we wouldn't have a chance to talk before Vizina, so I will leave you this message. 
I know there's much we both wish to say, but there will come a time for later in any case. A letter is no place to broach topics of such importance to us. Why I write you now, you have something to wait, have something waiting for you at the Royal Palace in Vizima. Consider it a gift from Amir and myself. You can pick it up at your leisure after your audience with him. When you exit the throne room, simply follow the covered walkway in the courtyard, turn right at the corner, and then take the first door on your left. You'll be inside the chamber with a fireplace. Take the door in the back right uh, to the adjoining room. There under the window, you'll find a chest with your gift, but in case these directions prove too complicated for you, I'm certain the Chamberlain will not hesitate to lead you there himself. Okay. I don't remember where we just picked this up, but uh, apparently we did. All right, we'll have to revisit that at the time when we end up back there. What's it gonna be? Only kills bastards. And horses. That's still downstairs. Was she just in the corner and I missed her? No oh, discounts, no credit. What's up, Yen? Oh my. Naughtiness. She's standing on the table at least now. Buy you a drink? I'm afraid the dishwater's as good as it gets in this establishment. <laughs> in Lorith. Why'd you pick it? Is that it? your idea of series? Series. Series. As I thought. I'm glad you went with her. Not mad? I thought you'd be angry. Angry? Why? Because you supported Siri in her decision? Or because you fought by her side and won? What if we'd lost? We wouldn't be having this conversation. And the female part of the continent's population would be drowning in tears. You won. No point bothering with what ifs. Talk to Triss. Reconvening the lodge? It's not going so well. Dangerous times, especially for sorceresses. Each thinks five times before sticking her <clears throat> neck out, and I can't blame them. Hmm. Charming place. Why are you here? You'll find out soon. In the meantime, tell me about Philippa. Triss and I found her and freed her. It turned out Dijkstra had her, but the situation's under control. That's a relief. So, gonna tell me why you're here? I was able to establish Margarita's whereabouts, the prison in Oxenford. I also learned the identity of the man who escaped from there. He should arrive shortly. What do you know about this fugitive? I know he's the only one ever to escape from Derard. Every guardsman in the city now seeks him. Sure he can be trusted? We'll soon find out. He just walked in. Oh my. One of the things about the Witcher is they do recycle faces quite a lot. Abbe Faria? Who's asking? We'd like to talk. Except uh, his recycled face is dirty. <sighs> Best run and get him. How did he push Geralt down? Place. You choose. All right. These humans are wilder by the day. Damn it! Scale the ladder. Guess I'm in for a roof walk. Thought you'd agreed to meet. I said I'd found him, not that I'd spoken to him. What do you want from me? Let me be! Calm down, we just want to chat. <clears throat> uh, and then stick a shift between my ribs. Leave me in the gutter. Look at us. Do we look like bandits to you? Uh, no. No, not really. I'm glad you agree. Besides, you'd be worthless to us dead. So you... you shan't hurt me. No. You're gonna tell us your story, then be on your way. 
Uh, yeah, I think Geralt well, would be pretty solid, right? Be it. But we, uh, we really ought to go back to Kate's. It's unwise to linger in the One street. One second, guys. Drink up. It'll help. Thanks. What do you want? To get into Derard. Find a hunter. Tell them you practice magic. They'll they'll lock you up lickety split. We need to get in without anyone noticing. Tell us how you escaped, then get on with your life. Uh, let's see. Start with one. They say no one gets out of Dayrod alive. Aye, oh, so they say. My thought? Why not try it dead? But they'd burn the corpses. They didn't start burning them until they'd learned an old fellow like myself had escaped. Before, they dropped the stiffs into a great pit. The pit's connected to the sewers, and the sewers empty into the river. And once you reach the river, you're as free as a fish. That's true, Jay. So you played dead. No one caught on? As a youth, I'd apprentice with an apothecary in Silverton. Learned a thing or two about herbs. Sleeping mushrooms grew on the walls of my cell. And I found Belladonna in the prison yard. Just had to mash them together and eat the pulp an hour before evening rounds. You might have lost your life. I prefer to die on my own terms, but that to be my fate. So theoretically, we could get in the way you got out. Assuming we don't mind the company of decomposing corpses. And assuming <laughs> you can squeeze through the grate. They barred the outlet to the river after I escaped. Huh. Explosives could take care of that. For that would be subtle. To hear us? I have a better plan. Exactly. Oxenfurt was built on elven ruins. Which have to connect to the sewers somewhere. <coughs> if we can find a way into the ruins. We'll get into the prison. It's a lot of stuff to find. They say Dayron's better guarded than the keep at Vicovaro. They choose the guards from among witch hunters. The worst dregs. Rabid fanatics. If you only knew what they'd do to folk. Torture every day. The wheel, the rack. We only knew peace on holidays when they'd drink themselves blind. Is they're allowed to drink on duty? Not officially, but you know how it is. See? Wasn't so hard. One last bit of advice. Find a new tavern. Still here, Pookie. Everyone here knows you. Thank you. Whatever your plans, I hope they work out. So do we. So long. You enjoying it? Awesome. What he said about the guards could prove handy. True. Things will go more smoothly if we can get even a few of them drunk. Zoltan ought to manage it. I'll ask him. Let's meet on the Oxenfurt Bridge. My print. A little stuck there yet? Experience. What level are we now? 32. All right. I'm gonna ask Zoltan for help. <coughs> Is he back at the Dandelions? Yeah. Let's go talk to Zoltan. We can get out of this lovely establishment. Rodanian soldier boys oh, are so tired. Easy. Oh. You mean me to grab another lass to join us? No, I was sick. I met you, Might as well do this the easy way. My wife won't believe me when I tell her. You miss seeing me play this? Yeah. It was the save the save was from October 2020. So yeah, definitely a few minutes ago. Luckily I still had it though. Pretty good at saving saves. Zoltan. And there's always Steam Cloud too. They're holding Margarita at Dayrod. Got a plan to break her out, but we need your help. 
What should I do? Load a wagon with as much Mahakaman as you can find and drive it to Oxenford. Yennefer will give the signal. They'll drive through the gates and treat the guards. Oh, these are terrible times. Since the mages left town, the hunters have taken to harassing non-humans. A dwarf lingering around the prison gates only stands to attract attention. Right. Didn't think of that. I'll go straight to Yen in that case. She went to find a way into the ruins beneath the city. Okay. So, he can't nice help. Nice talking to you, Zoltan. See you later. There was... It must have been a situation in which he could have done it. So I guess it has to do with the uh, it even sounds the political situation. That, by the way, on the stage is my stash. <laughs> Very private. I don't know where that was from. But I'll take it. Ooh. it. Suddenly got very loud. The volume definitely oscillates quite a bit. You must sweat like the swine in that jacket. I serve the eternal fire. I think that's when your right eye went blind for a few weeks. Oh man. If there's to be mud, might as well be rain. Well, I'm glad you got through all that. Vasty, eh? And then them had that similar issue, right? Your kind spreads disease, defeatism, and desertion. How far are we going? Oh, this is too far to run. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's go here to the cunny of the goose and get the uh, signpost. Your ass is right too. Either that or we could call a roach. Where is it? Uh, to my left. That reptile gaze of yours don't scare. Should we pick up some more missions? Ah. Uh. Oh yeah, I remember this place. Signpost is in a weird place. Yeah, the videos are all still there. <laughs> Did any of them get completely yeeted? I don't think so. I don't remember though. Yeah, Nem had dried eyes. You had an inflamed optic nerve. Yay. Yeah, all 134 of them. <laughs> Talk about a little back catalog. Alright, let's go to here. I almost called this number 135, but I thought that would put people off. <coughs> There's my lady. Geralt! Find a way in. Several. Nearest is through a well not far from here. Did you arrange any help? We'll manage on our own. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Okay. I'll follow you. Sure, the guards don't know about the passage through the ruins. Haven't planted sentries there. They haven't. How can you be sure? Novigrad's hierarchs have taken great care to eradicate any and all memories of the city's elven roots. Even if anyone remembers the ruins are there, they have no recollection of how far and where they extend. And I'm absolutely certain no one's thought to place sentries there. Hope you're right. The mark of a dangerous guild. Yeah, those were back in the day when I was streaming this on Twitch, and then I would cut the episodes up and put them onto uh, onto YouTube. So it's 134 episodes, but they're not at all eight hours long. They're like an hour Crap or two touch. each. Mark of the devil. Here we are. This is it. Hmm. Boulder was plugging the well until recently. Due to an edict Hamelfart issued some years ago. 
but I managed to find two brawny and obliging passers-by who agreed to remove the impediment, for a modest fee, naturally. Naturally? Here. What is this? Use She's it so posh. once you find Rita. I'll be able to pinpoint your location. Not coming? Mucking through ruins and sewers? Hmm, I'd rather leave it to the expert. <laughs> Meaning you'd rather waltz in once the hard work's done? Of course. Wet clothes. Oh, joy. That's what she's got me for. Alright, are we just jumping in here? Apparently. Search the ruins. I don't remember what game we were on when we switched off Twitch. It was Cyberpunk. Um, I'd started Cyberpunk on Twitch, but then I got... I was having problems uh, with the graphics, and so that's when I bought my 3090, and then I could stream in 1440. So I used that to... Um, that torch here. So I use that to uh, um, be my reason, basically, to um, Tomb Raider. come over to like YouTube, because I could stream in better quality here than I could on Twitch. And I brought the uh, the episodes I started Cyberpunk with, and then um, continued on from there. Oh, we got a grave hag. Nice. All right, not here. Oh god. Okay, this is not where I wanted to fight her. Oh god. She keeps drowning. This is bad. I'm stuck. 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 Can't fight back. Oh god. Don't let a grave hag catch you in the water. Holy moly. We nearly died. That was rough. She had me stun locked. So this is a mod that lets me fight with a uh, with a torch. I thought it was good for the stream, so you guys can see. All right. Ah, uh, oh, here we go. Mechanism's broken. Missing a piece. Place it with something else, maybe. Okay. All right, not here. Yeah, it's no fun for me either, that's for sure. <laughs> That little sound. Something's under there. Hmm. Loot. Ooh, diagram for a sword. Mahamakan. Take that and go back, I assume. So we get all this nice loot. <gasps> 
is cool. Alright, how do we get back up? Over here. I wonder if I missed any loot down there. Something to fight under there. Let's not worry about it. We have to move along. We have a story to finish. We got a whole end fight to do. I know how to do it. Enter the sewers. Wall looks brittle. That would be the way. There's some baddies in there. Breaks in here. Taking a lot of damage. Give me a second. Ghouls. What are ghouls? Ghouls are. Are they necrophages? They are. We need a little necrophage oil. Put a little lead on there, please. Thank you. One down. Until they're all dead. Where'd he go? Are we done? Are we done here? Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's the stuff I broke open. Maybe I'll see that other one later. Let's go back this way. Oh, he's back. Show me what you got. Monster tongue. Gotta get the mutagens. Looks like we're going this way, I assume. Oh, that's locked, okay. Guess we're going this way. Oh, lovely. Come on, come closer. Okay. I think we can put this way now. Parrying at some point. Sewer key. There we go.
So, I wonder if we're going to go back the other way. No much queer. Probably right, since we got the key. Let's take a peek up here. Alright, let's go back here before we alert somebody else. Oh no. This takes us back out. Maybe that's our exit. All right. We still got the key. Up, buddy, I'm gonna try one parry here. Come on! Oh yeah, I can do it. Yep. Wrong button. That's the button I want. That's what I want. I get those parries in, it what makes it more this? fun. Found her. Margarita. Who? Who's that? Geralt. God, I'm hallucinating. Getting you out of here. No chance. We'll both die in here. Sheila. They captured her first. Her condition's critical. No. It's pointless. Never open it without the key. The warden keeps them with him at all times. His room is upstairs. Be right back. Yeah, I remember this was a little bit rough of a fight, but I think we'll get it. I right, gotta get the key. It wants me to go that way. I gotta visit the little monkey's room one more time, guys. Uh, he's gotta can't be distracted for this bit. So uh, I'll be right back. Forget to watch the monkey mitts. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so. Slow here. I think I keep toggling walk. Maybe that's just how you walk in here. Apparently, sprinting should get me out of it. 
I'm gonna just make sure I'm ready for this. So that's sprinting. There we go. That's what I want. And I guess we're just slow in here. Alright, yeah, the guard is... Or the guy with the key is, like, way up there. But there's a bunch of guys we're gonna have to fight first. Oh, that is just a glitch, isn't it? Purple cobwebs. Is this the guy? It might be. Not the guy we wanted. Maybe try to be quiet. <laughs> yeah, it's a little hard when I'm killing everybody. Wondrous world of insectoids. That's my weight. We're still good. I'll do a big massive selling of things uh, between streams. Gotta make those ducats. Alright, so not there. And there's no way to go from here. So we gotta go out here. I wonder if there's a way to like draw people in. Not that. Let's uh use the crossbow. Can I shoot one and have him come in? I cannot do that right now. Oh god, okay. Get round this right! Raise the barricade! Shit! Archers on the roof! All of us to their stations! I'm gonna get those archers. These guys. Alright, this may not go well. Shields. I will kill you. I want him alive. Alive. Do it. No. Yes. Let's do this quick. Quicker. Maybe. Maybe. I gotta get this guy. All right, we got this. Get it from both sides. Get behind him. There we go. Little art. Let's do the shields. Get it from both sides. More guys coming. Up. Fighting the whole place at once, huh? Yeah, with the shield first. When you got that finisher. No, you're done. Or maybe not. Well, that's the guy we're after. Well, he likes to parry, huh? 
What was that about being quiet, Jay? <laughs> Let's do this quick. Quick. If anyone can take down the whole prison system, it's Geralt. Yes. Why waste time looking around, huh? That's the cell key. That wasn't so bad. It's funny, coming in cold, I'm actually a lot better at this than I was uh, back when we played it last. Maybe it's all that Elden Ring and everything in between. Get everything? Gotta go loot his uh, office too before we're out of here. Where was it? Witch Slayer. Hmm. Maybe it was the other way. I said trying. <laughs> we did not try very hard. <laughs> no. It's similar enough to Conan 2 that's not too rusty. Yeah. Quick. Oh, hi. Quick. You forgot the part where everybody came down to fight me, guy. This has got to be some uh, yummy treasure up in the uh, captain's room, right? The warden's room? Quicksilver? Do it yourself. How to avoid colossal vessels. <laughs> Oh, there's a note. List of prisoners. Let's read that. There's a lot of them. Sardukar, Reptile Man, Sid Spiker. So this was the one um, who was dying, I think. Silly, Cilia, prison imprisoned for the practice of herbalism and publication of banned utterances. Recommendation: enhanced interrogation using hot irons. Maybe Margarita Zalona. Anyway, we're good. Wondrous world of insectoids. Okay, um, any more goodies in here? Should we take a bath? Get all that blood off of us? Oh, there's something here to loot. Can't miss the ladle. All right, let's go back. Now that we killed everybody, she was on the list as Margarita. I just missed it. Okay, leave it to me. Um, let's see a little bit better. What, 
What are you doing? Yen insisted on coming. Look at those boots. With the heels. Rita. Sheila. When I get Sheila. my hands on the sons of bitches. You know, I shan't make it. Hold on. You must hold on. <laughs> she can't do like a healing spell or something. They give her some of my potion. I'm dying, Yana. I'm a sorceress. Let me die with dignity. Give you some of my swallow. She's looking at. Oh my god. She wants me to kill her. Oh. All right. I'll do it. Yen, get Rita out of here. Geralt. Yena. For once. Don't argue with him. So sad. I can't pass through the portal with you both. You'll need to get out on your own. Don't like portals anyway. Go. Don't like portals anyway. Funny. There was a time I'd have asked you not to do this. No, you'd never have asked. You're too proud. No, oh, at least we don't have to watch. Why couldn't we give her our potion? Meh. All right, we gotta get out of the prison. Apparently there's more loot I didn't pick up. Uh, anyway, I think we came in this way. Alright, stop it. Stop it, monkey. You don't have to loot everything. Um... up here? No. no. That's where we went. I want to go to where the uh, sewer key was. It was this way, right? I don't remember. How do we get in here? Hmm. Yeah, no, we might as well steal their crap. This is... There was a way I got to her. I mean, I can get out that way. It's fine. But, uh... We had the key for the sewer escape and everything. More people. Can't get them out that way. I swear to God. Came in a different way. I wish I could let them all out. Hmm. Maybe they closed it off, or maybe... Oh, it's this one. Here we go.
quest completed. <laughs> Hero potions don't work on NPCs. Sad sadness. Oh, I can't get out that way. I don't know where we are. Whose stuff we're stealing? How do I get out? A lot of books. Take them to the bookseller. We make all the monies to uh, upgrade our armors. Can we get out this way? No, we came from that way. I think that was the door I'd want to get out of here. But there was uh, one more here. No, we came in that way. How about this way. Oh, here we go. Ooh, through the railing. No problem. We got this. All right, we got to meet her at and the lodge at Dandelion's Inn. Twerk mages at all, they say. Who then? One man. Fought his way past the guards and fled. You daft. Oh right, this we're uh, a long ways away. I need to do this. Can't walk through people, can't walk through railings. <laughs> right? Did we calls? They hate you too, fat girl. Another drift of Be nice. Oh, it's such a party here. Okay, we're supposed to meet Yen and all the sorceresses. Where are they? Downstairs, apparently. Oh, they're down still. Is there a basement? It's a material world. Oh, you think I would remember this stuff? I don't see stairs down. Is there a place around the back? Oopsie. Oh, he's a war veteran. Spare me a crown. Hmm. We don't need to go in the ditch. Yeah, there's a little down arrow on the uh, on the indicator. Although there's also a couple up arrows. Maybe you gotta go up to go down. I'm confused. Now it's flipping up and down. Look at that. 
Are they gonna be in the ruby room, maybe? Let's check that out. Oh, there's... There's Siri. Geralt. What is it? Nothing just yet, but something's afoot. Philippa and Margarita want to speak to me. Uh, what about... They say about what? No, but I have my suspicions. I bet they have plans for me. And they're deigning to inform me of them. Uh, you'll do fine on your own. I think this is one of the crucial ones right here. Got nothing to be afraid of. Just go. Listen to what they have to say. And if they try to force me into something? Can't believe you'd ever let them. Margarita's only ever cared about your education. Doubt she'll try to drag you into politics. Philip is tougher, plays a mean game, but ultimately respects those who hold to their views. If she makes you an offer, and you firmly turn it down, she'll respect that. Thanks, Carol. Well, go. Don't give him any more time to strategize. All right. That was the right answer. We believe in her. Not going with her. Can't hold her hand if they're going to take her seriously. True. Good decision. Good decision. Relax. She'll now that one didn't even have a timer. So Rita it's not true that all the important Philippa. ones have timers. She can be ruthless. Siri's been in tougher situations and come out of them all right. True. We managed to instill some principles, skills that have helped. Exactly. So there's nothing to be afraid of. Of course. I'll just have a peek. <laughs> Stop spying. Don't spy on her. You really have that little faith. I don't trust Philippa and Rita. So why do you even allow this meeting to happen? For the same reason you did. If they're to respect her, she can't be seen to be hanging on to my apron strings. What do you see? Philippa pontificating. Siri pacing wall to wall. She stopped. She's saying something. Philippa's turned pale. That's my Siri. Probably gave her an earful. Quiet! Here she comes. So? You were eavesdropping? Yes. No. Oh, you haven't changed a bit. <laughs> Tell us what you talked about. I'd rather not. Not yet, at least. Of course. When you're ready. Wait for it to get slammed in the forest. Get slammed in the face. Yeah, it opened we the other way. We need to sail to Avalok's waiting at the port. Of course. I'll be there soon. Just wanted to. Go meet Avalok. He wished to see you, apparently. So, apparently that was a... Uh... Oh, level 34. We could go make that armor. We're probably fine. We should just get this done. We'll get on the whole thing that way. Quest completed. Final preparations. New quest, battle preparations. So this one um, has a critical decision too. Um, that was the one in this whole quest here was getting to that one where I said she'll be fine on her own. Um, and then this one... Okay. I know what I need to do. Just at least at the critical points. Right, we gotta go meet Avalok on his ship. That means we're sailing out. So we gotta go over here. How's my stuff? 77%. Sixty-four percent. Alright, we should do. A little repair. 
Oh, you know, I may have had some and they were over here. <laughs> okay, I was looking in the wrong place. Alright, let's just do this. Alright, that's at 100%. And that is at 100%. How's my armor? 66. This one, 88. Some of that. And do some of that. Okay. Oh, and uh, let's get a meditation into before we go. Get repair. Hey, Bayman. Did it. Got it. All right, we're all repaired. It's clear as the eternal fire. We probably have an advantage going to get the other armor, but you know what? For the purpose of brevity, let's see if we can do it with what we've got. Mutant. Certain citizen sermon. It's going to be all about the situation with the uh, the non-humans. Trouble. Wonderful. And then as we go along in the Your next episode, we'll do more upgrading and stuff like that. <laughs> but I may not even have all the ingredients I need. Oh, here's dude. What's up, dude? Apparently the sword he gives is now better. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? I think I sold it. Listen. Would you craft something for me? Um. Yeah, I got this sword from him that was really good, but uh, it wasn't. I mean, it was supposed to be really good, but it wasn't. Apparently, it's better now. Oh. Uh, how much damage does my stuff do now? Let's see. Any of this stuff is better. I gotta get out of here. Since we so just ran, ran past him. Alright, we've got the steel one. Does uh, 227 to 277. So let's just remember the upper numbers. 277 and 411. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? Listen, would you craft something for me? Okay, so we want uh, silver swords. So yeah, 411 was our top one. That one's 444. That's a little bit better. And that's his... Highest level one? Oh, the negotiator. <laughs> I have to be one one more level for that. The Wolven Silver Sword. That's the appropriate one for my level. What do I need? I need the Wolven Silver Sword. Superior. And for that, I need... Enhanced. I wonder if I have that in my stash. We can make one. Should we make a woven silver sword? Uh, let's see if we can do it. We got this, no problem. Okay. Now we need this. Oh, we can buy them. Okay, let's make this. Okay, and then superior. Let's make that. And the master crafted. All right, we've made all those. Now let's look at um, 
steel swords. Let's see if there's any that are better. Are there woven steel swords? This one is the one we want. So we need to make this. And then this one. Does he not have any more? Oh, he doesn't. Uh, can we make a dark steel ingot? Mm. We can. Should have just done that to start with. Okay. Now we can make this. Um, and then we want to go to superior. We need more steel ink, dark steel ingots. We may need even more, but let's just do this. Okay, so we can make the superior. And then we can make the master crafted. Nice. All right, so we've upgraded both of our swords. Now we need to look at um, the... Uh, Watch so long. Uh, the uh, yeah, let's go ahead and sort items. I type. Yes. These uh, the the glyphs. Okay, so what do I got in these ones? Greater glyphs. I've got this. This gives uh, things to intensity. Yeah, these are all greater. and uh, I don't have that many greater ones. Lesser. I got some... Regular ones. Let's see what he's got. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How I'm might I be remind about? myself of all these things. Let me see what you got. What do you have on offer? Uh, what's he got? What's he got? What's he got? Oh, and these. I forget which are for which, right? Oh, this is armor. This is weapons. Oh, I was looking at the wrong side again. Here we go. Chance to cause burning, chance to poison, armor piercing. So the elf we're going to fight, do we fight him with steel? I think, or are elves with silver? Pretty sure there was steel, right? Because we want the one that we fight the boss guy with to be the best. Does anybody know? I got some maps and stuff. I could look it up if nobody knows. Let's see. Witcher 3, Elves, Steel, or Silver. You use steel against sentient beings like humans, elves, and trolls. So we want to put the best stuff in our steel one right now. Okay. Cool. And so we got some good stuff there. What does he have? Does he have any greater ones? Attack power is good. <clears throat> Let's buy this. And I don't know if he has any other greater ones. Okay. Thank you, sir. And I don't know if I can put them in myself or if I have to have him. So do long. 
Let's see. And can I take them out of other ones? <laughs> Not that way. Uh, all right. Anyway, let's equip these. Do a little bit better. Instead of armor, we made weapons, which seems like a pretty good idea. We just won't get hit, right? Um, sort. And it can uh, we remove them from them? Or do we have to have dude do that? Uh, I remember all this stuff. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? Mm. Listen, would you craft something for me? Oh, remove upgrade. There we go. Oh, they'll be destroyed. No, that's not helpful. Okay, so you can remove them, uh, but you can't. So long. Get them back. You just make space for the other one. All right, now let's see if we can do this ourselves or if we're going to have him do this. So, attack power, chance to cause burning, chance to cause poison. Both of those are great. Sign intensity, armor piercing, chance to freeze. All right, so we definitely want armor piercing, right? So let's put that on steel. And then do we want attack power or do we want chance to burn? Chance to poison. I think the chance to cause dots in them is pretty good. Or chance to freeze, which will slow him down. Chance to stagger is not bad. Sign intensity is not bad. I like freeze, I think, because... Uh, that will slow him down and give us an advantage, right? Although these will do actual damage. Let's do freeze and poison. And then for the silver one, we'll do burning, attack power, and sign intensity. Hopefully we made good choices. We shall see. But that's a definite upgrade. Yeah, we were at like 277 and 444 and now we're at 499 and 348 so this one we're gonna fight the boss with is like 70 damage more 71 damage maximum damage more which should help a lot and they're the wolf ones and i'm the wolf so they're thematically appropriate and they'll go with our wolf armor when we make it Wild egg. Help protect Siri from the wild hunt, and the Emperor will grant you amnesty. I hope we can trust you. You can. What a fringilla. That I don't know, but I shall take it up with him. You barely said hello, and you're already plotting something. It's clearly in our nature. <laughs> I hear right. You convince the Emperor to pardon them? Provided they help us defend Ciri. Hmm. Got a hard time believing Emperor would go in for a deal like that. If you can't believe it, don't. Finally walk through a I don't need you to. <laughs> Bit about Frangilla. What was that? Chris told me you couldn't contact her. Perhaps because she sits in the Emperor's dungeon, chained in Dimeritium. 
At least that's what Rita implied. Hmm. Take it the Emperor forgot to tell you about this. I don't like it. That was not our deal. When it's all over, I'll need to have a candid discussion with the Emperor. Come. They're it's all good she's got his us. ear. Okay. All gave me something. Oh, you make a fine sailor. What's up, Tris? What's up, Siri? Got a minute? Of course. Uh, oh my god, these are a lot of different questions. Uh, we probably won't see her again afterwards for a long time, so uh, even if she's alive, let's ask questions. Once you'd left Yen and me on the Isle of Avalon, what happened to you? What did you do? I traveled through time, space, different worlds. I saw houses of glass, ran with unicorns at the world's end. Wow. Even lived in an undersea kingdom for a time. Awesome. <laughs> Freedom. Always had a taste for it. I still do. So why'd you return? <sighs> it was too much. I almost drowned in it. When everything is possible, it quickly becomes a lot less alluring. Siri's cool, man. If I wasn't Geralt, her dad, um, she would be a great one to romance. Although, can't pin her still. And uh, she's got stuff to do. Traveling between worlds, what's it like? It's nice. Difficult? It was at first, but in time it became automatic, like riding a horse. Bet a lot of mages would love to learn to do it. I'm certain they would. But Avalach claims they've neither the knowledge nor talent. He spent four centuries learning to do it, yet can still only find and pass through pre Four centuries? Courses. I go wherever I please, whenever I please. Pretty cool. So, need your advice about Yennefer. Very well. Ask away. The thing is, I'd like to take her somewhere once it's over. Someplace picturesque, beautiful even, where we can rest. You've been almost everywhere. Also know Yen well. Any ideas? I was thinking Spala or maybe Dolblathana. <coughs> the first roadside inn you pass, take her there. Pay for a month in advance, carve do not disturb into the room door, and shut it behind you. <laughs> Just like that? Just like that. <laughs> okay, Siri. Make me Heritage blush. located you time and again. How's that work? When I pass between worlds, I create a kind of shockwave. Anyone properly trained can sense it. That's how Avalach explains it, at any rate. He can do it too. So you shouldn't actually ever use your power. It's not like that. The impulse is stronger the longer my voyage. On short hops, the disturbance is practically imperceptible. Alright. Good talk. I should go. Alright. We'll talk later. Alright, well, we're supposed to talk to Avalach. This guy. All are present. You were the last to arrive. Might we set sail? Yeah, let's go. Anchors away. There we go. Skelligal Isles, Undvik. <laughs> oh, look at them. Ian loves it. Yen likes it and she's worried. Love 
11 when she does magic. Well, that settles the question of His Imperial Majesty's whereabouts. Does he aim to conquer Skelligan? But he, he knows. Those are my friends. He wishes to grant you the Isles, with Sintra and the rest of the Empire. There is an upside to all this. Is that so? The Emperor will have to help us fight the hunt. And we've just found Frangilla Vigo. We must hurry and find the Sunstone. Seems we've plenty to do in Skelliger after that. Fringilla Vigo. We need her here. Um, which of these is it? Let's ask two. At the moment, we don't even know what the Sunstone is. It was created so the Mountain Elves could summon the vessels of the NL. Now it merely serves as a symbol of a lost opportunity to unite the two tribes. Truly. That was a funny look. Can all of you be unfamiliar with the story of Galban and Dillion of the White Fleet? Apparently. Dallas, please. Absolutely love elven legends. Gelban was a sage of the Elder Elves. He fell in love with an Enshe elf, Dillian. Yet, she spurned him. Ahem. <laughs> that was a jest on Geralt's part. Too late. It won't hurt any of you to know <laughs> Too late. This. On the day the White Fleet was to <laughs> I set sail, know. Gelban gave Dillian a gift. The Sunstone. He believed Dillian's heart would soften in time. Once her longing for him burgeoned, she was to use the Sunstone. All right, Sterling. Good night, worlds man. Thanks away, for hanging out. He would return for her. Sounds promising. Let's just hope this sunstone proves more useful to us than it did to that elf woman. Yeah, you should catch the end. Uh, right now we're at uh, 5.30, 5 hours and 30 minutes into it. Probably be another hour before it's done. Raymats, uh, what, you're back? What did you miss? Um, I went through all the quests until this one, the uh, battle preparations. We're on a ship. And we're going to probably be getting to the end battle pretty soon. Um, we just saw the Emperor's ships. And Avalok is now uh, telling us stories about elven legends, about where the Sunstone came from. Oh, and I, I crafted, um, or had crafted, uh, two mastercrafted woven swords, which are the highest level sword I can carry right now. So that hopefully will be helpful. I did not go make the woven armor. I probably could have, should have, would have, but uh, it's okay. We'll we'll see how well we do with this. Um, yeah, so I'm more interested in how to use the sunstone. What I want to know is if we'll be able to use the sunstone. You? No. Me? Naturally. With a touch of help from the sorceresses. Of whom some are below deck vomiting, while others remain unreachable. Um... And I've been uh, making all the right choices along the way, by the way. So we should get the good ending. The Sunstones or my chosen good ending anyway. How do we know that? From legends. Elven once. It lies where the White Fleet landed centuries ago. Meaning anywhere on any one of the Isles. Splendid. Ermion. I'll talk to him. Know where he is? I'll ask around the port. Kroch's longships are moored there. Can you teleport me onto Amir's ship? Not a chance. It's better shielded than the Emperor's alcove. Though we could try to force our way through. We need Fringilla in one piece. Think they know we're here? Amir's mages, of course. If the matter of Fringilla Vigo were resolved, they'd probably just send her over here in a skiff. It's far from resolved. The Emperor pledged to ensure the Lodge's safety, but- Fringilla's a pricklier matter. She's his subject, one officially sentenced to death for treason. You'll need to learn what Amir has planned for her, once we've found a way to toss you over to the Imperial flagship. I'll get on the Emperor's ship myself. 
A plan to swim? With swords on your back? You'll get shot up like a sitting duck before you can say, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Don't panic. He'll find a way. That's right. Make your approach by night. You'll stand a better chance then. And once you're on board, show his Imperial Majesty this letter. Hand it to him directly. We should remind him what he promised and what he'll get in return. I thought she had his ear. But we gotta sneak on still. I hope the, she waterproofed that letter. <laughs> I'm off. It's gonna be a little soggy. Good luck. He doesn't look very huggable in that with the spikes. Your Imperial Majesty, allow me to remind you that our arrangement encompassed all the sorceresses wishing to take part in the risky endeavor whose success is so vital to us. I find it hard to believe that in the current situation when I have already succeeded in gathering so many members of the Lodge, you would refuse to allow Frangilla Vigo to join our company. Crazy Mom! Okay. Jump in from now. Have to go to work, see the rest later. See you later. I'm glad you've been here. Understand there are personal factors that make you reluctant to part with your subject, but I assure you our interests are aligned in those matters as well. I promise that I will, uh, will uphold the conditions of our arrangement, despite the fact that they will demand sacrifices of, of me and will leave me in an unfortunate situation. What is that? Should I be worried for her? I therefore, I therefore request, politely yet, with great insistence, that you release Fringilla. With all due respect, Yennefer. All right, that ought to do it. <laughs> Okay. Ask Crack where Ermion is. Boy, fucking shot. I thought you wished to see Crack. Ah, uh, so. What if I disappear again? For good this time, like my mother He's down here. Oh, yeah, because we're in Skellige now. Easy. Hmm? Was it hard? Killing the ice, Jack? Killing that vermin? Hey? Thanks a lot. Crack on crack. Did you see? The black dogs in their rickety tubs. They bay at our gates, seek to strike fear in our hearts. Saw them all. Where's Ermion? Went to see Lugas. An uncrate on the throne remains a thorn in his ass. <laughs> now he's seen the black ones, it pricks him even harder. The druid's gone to reason with the dim-witted knob. I think I'll join Ermion. Need to talk to him. Go. And when you see that bloody twit Lugas, be sure and tell him... Uh, best not. The druid knows what to say. Farewell. Eye on you. Okay. Talk to Ermion, who is... Best not worth shite if a week... Where is he? Way down there. What? Where am I? I'm up there. Well, damn. Okay. <laughs> Care Mirror. All right, let's do it from the signpost. Got me running halfway across Galaga. Or all the way, really. Hey. I've half a mind to go make that wolf armor. Let's, since we're. Fast traveling everywhere. All right, where is he? Respect, Witcher. Oh, this is the place I liberated. I think this is the uh, prison that had the Easter egg wanted. of uh, Tyrion. You, Tyrion Lannister. The 
favor Lady Bran did for her son sure did bear. What else would crack have? He not content at the moment. Yeah, I'll not kneel before an oncrite, never. That clear to you? You prefer to aid the black ones? I'd sooner write the rights of bleeding more hog than let crack rule all Skelliger. And your men, what do they say? Will they follow you when the Yars call you a traitor? This here is my land, Druid. Watch your words. Would you be king by Nilfgaard's grace? That's your bark before you bite. Did Crack send you here for my head? Well then go ahead! Try to take it! Get him! Uh oh. Oh, he got him. Without my help. That guy up there. Alright, I get this guy up here. Ow! Oh god, I'm almost dead. That was rough. I didn't even notice that. Okay, we're... We'll be alright now. I got saved by my skill. That, uh... The one that uh, gives me a chance if I, if I get down to the death point. I forgot what's called Undying. Gotta do all the looting. Cause I am a loot monger. Alright, we gotta talk to him outside of the territory. Do we talk to him first? Come. We should not stay here. Do I gotta follow him or what? Come. Are you stuck? We should not stay here. I just gotta get out myself. Are everybody else gonna fight me or what? Apparently. Can't get out. That chance to freeze. How do I get out? Oh, there it is. Try not to kill y'all. Is he gonna come down here? I got some little dots, so I think I'm good. Pick up 
pick up some uh, Witcher contracts here. <laughs> Oof, that's enough. Wait, wait. This one's really funny. Wait, wait. <laughs> this one's really funny. Well, Geralt, I see no row can occur in Skellige without your participation. Mean and inaccurate, Ermion. Seems to me I've missed quite a few. The blood of Crocs' blood sits upon the throne, and that is your doing. I'm afraid you've ignited a small civil war. I have. The men had shed each other's blood in the quest for Skellige's crown. Politics as usual, just a difference of degree. Yet the bloody feast at Kaer Trolda was different. It was dishonorable, treacherous, needed investigation. More witcher's work. Work that culminated with the crowning of the Isle's new queen. All the previous politics in Skellige... So, Clan Drummond will attack sooner than we expected, it seems. Thought Croc sent you to negotiate an agreement with Lugas. Ha! <laughs> an agreement? Only Croc believes such a thing possible at this stage. You mean I didn't actually ruin things for you? Not this time. Lugas' death stands to change a great deal. His cousin, who will now be named Jarl, is a weak commander. Stupid. This war will start soon, and even sooner. But why have you returned to Skellige? All oh, those textures on them look so good. How's Ceres handling things? As the makings of an excellent queen, if she would only flee her father's shadow. Everyone, Lugas accepted, declared their support for her. Yet the minute the Imperial fleet appeared on the horizon, the Jarl took matters into his own hands. And the Yalmar? <clears throat> And the lads led three raids against the Imperial fleet, all against Crack's will, all failed. Uh, yet he'll find volunteers for another. Yeah, sounds like Yalmar. Listen, Ermian, know anything about the Sunstone? Legends place it somewhere in Skellige. The Mask of Ulberus first, now the Sunstone. Monsters may rest easy. You've become a treasure hunter. <laughs> I've never found the Enshe elves interesting. But there's a scald, Avent. He could help you. Once told me of some inaccessible caverns or ruins or some such. Where will I find him? Today? In Arambjorn, doubtless. You might also ask the pearl divers, Erling and Matthias Fishlong. Of late, they hunt near the tip of the bay. Eastern end. Fish lung? Interesting. So they call him. Submerges for hours at a time. None know how he does it, but I've my suspicions. I bet he's got a little cave he goes into. Him. It's nothing personal. I couldn't stand his father or grandfather either. Thanks for your help. One thing, Garrett. These caves are ruins. Matthias and Erling's ancestors would have looted them bare centuries ago were they not protected by some magic barrier. Take a sorceress with you. You must have brought at least one along. All gaggle this time. Uh, gods protect us. <laughs> All right, we got to uh, talk to the bard known as Avind. Apparently, I have talked to the Pearl Diver before. All right, where's Avend? This is such a thing in, in their plan. They're like, okay, let's go there and do this. All we need is this one relic that hasn't been found forever. It'll be fine. <laughs> oh, wow, we have a level 12 quest here. A level 13 quest. All right, what's my quickest way here is Unborn. All right, my current position is there. That was the nearest signpost. They might kill me if I go back there. Protect us from the gaggle. It'll be fine. Oh, yeah, oh, it will be fine. I just might have to kill more of them. Ah. 
Okay, we got the whole plan. All right, Geralt. Go find this thing that no one has known where it is for centuries. <laughs> and then we'll finish the plan. Okay, no problem. Just wait here. by the gate. And you know, <laughs> while we're teleporting, I wasn't going to do this because I thought we were like going straight for the end thing. But just so I look good at the end. Um, and just for completionism. Let's do this. I've got the chess piece already made. So let's grab it. Now that we got the swords. And now that they've got this uh, nice signpost in the middle of uh, Cro Crow's Perch. Pamperan. Pamperan. I haven't heard that yet, this one. Pamperam. I got two more hours left. Ah. All right. Uh, we want that. Okay. That's 10 to 12. What's the crossbow I'm using now have? Oh, let's put these away. Nine to seven to nine. Oh, let's grab that other one. Not that I use these much. Okay. Not much of my stash. It's any old Witcher gear. We'll actually have to go back to one more time to put this away if they can do it. Oh, wrong thing. Okay, so this. Oh, we're going to need to put the things in it too. Is 100% repaired. And now we're not matching it at all, so we're definitely going to need the other ones. Geralt, good of you to come by. What can I do for you? Need some armor made. Witcher's armor. Okay, so... Uh, let's start with pants. Chest, we're good. All right, so we want all the... The woven ones. So we need the woven stuff. Okay, we need to make leather scraps. Um, crafting components. We should have, be able to make tons of that. The scraps. What happened? Uh, oh, are we good? No, we still need more. Why did it throw me down there? Does the Baron know you're here? <laughs> yeah, he is dead. Okay. Uh, so... Hopefully we're good now. Woven transfers, yes. 
Okay, and next is enhanced, right? Yeah, what do we need? More of these? Just, can we just buy some? Boom. And then superior? No. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong one. Uh, superior woven. Meteorite silver ingot. Let's make that. All right, superior woven trousers. And then that goes to the master crafted, right? Oh God, we need a monster egg. I know there was a way to get them. Um, yeah, let's see. Okay, we need one more meteorite. And then, wasn't there a way to get a monster egg from from other stuff? <coughs> oh, excuse me. It doesn't say here. But it was like breaking down something else. Does anybody remember? I'm going to look it up. Do we need the eggshell for a cod piece? <laughs> I don't know if I trust it much. Monster egg. It's obtained from certain monsters or by dismantling the following. Cockatrice egg and dragon embryo, griffin's egg, harpy egg, wyvern egg. All right. Uh, let's see. Can, do I just dismantle in my inventory? Uh, let's see. Let me get out of here. Oh, wait. I saw it. Need some armor made. I saw the dismantle. Armor. It was, uh, right there. So, we want to dismantle. I wish I could search. Um, cockatrice egg and draga. Are these in any kind of order? Harpy eggs. There we go. Dismantle. Just oh, let's dismantle, just in case we need more. Okay, we got that. Crafting. All right, and back to the trousers. Master crafted woven trousers, all parts here. Boom. All right, we got them. And then now we need um, boots and gloves, right? Some boots are up top. So we need straight woven first. What are we missing? Are she out of these? Crap. Okay. See, I knew we'd hit something like that. Uh, so for the crafting components, for the leather scraps, we're out of leather straps. Can we make the leather straps? That must be a dismantling thing, right? So dismantle. Yeah, we just gotta dismantle some things. No problem. We got plenty of leather. Cured leather, leather scraps. Got any other leathery things? We'll just break all this stuff down. Do, 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 do. 
Oh, we can break that down. And we can break this down. Uh, let's, uh, let's break down like 10 of them. Five of them. Okay. Back to crafting. So where were we? We were making the boots. Had we made them at all yet? Okay, now we're good. Okay, woven boots. And then enhanced. Uh, do we not have those? Ooh. I think this is what happened <laughs> before. Yeah. We got superior. But we're missing the enhanced. And then we've got master crafted. Gosh dang it. Yeah, we don't have the schematic for enhanced woven boots. All right, let's see if we can do the gloves. Might just have to do it without the boots. All right, um, gauntlets. Wolven. So far, so good. Excellent. Excellent. And master crafted. Awesome. So we're just missing um, the enhanced woven boots. Let's get some glyphs off her. Don't use Quinn a whole lot. I do use Axie. That's just regular. That's greater. Oh no, not Axie, Ard. All right, we'll see what I have first. Okay, thanks. Take care now. Yeah, so we got the uh, the gloves and the trousers. The boots match all right. Um, oh, these were the ones I owned. Mm -hmm. Wait, I don't want to put any lessers. Put regulars. We could do like a whole bunch of Igni intensity. That's pretty good. Can we put more than one? can always remove them later. Oh, we can. Yeah, let's just get really intense Igni. <laughs> we use them all. Let burn the heck out of them. Alright, excellent. What do these have? These are just superior Griffin boots. Uh, we might as well make them mastercrafted, right? If we can. Um, these are all in treasure hunts. I don't have one for the, uh, what should we call it? For the, uh, the boots, the woven boots. All right, let's see if she can upgrade our boots. We, ours were, um, Superior. Let's see if we can turn him into Mastercrafted. Geralt, good of you to come by. What can I, will I do roll for with you? That. 
We'll roll with that. I don't know, is there is made. there a full Witcher's suit? Armor. There must be a full suit. Um bonus. Here we go. Mastercrafted Griffin. I just need to make one more meteorite silver ingot. I think we can do. This is why I save all this crap. Alright, mastercrafted griffin boots. Sweet. Farewell. Actually. What are you selling? What's good? Boop. Oh, this, again, I'm looking at me. I'm such a dummy. You're. She's just got lesser glyphs. And she doesn't have any witcher armor. Alright, farewell. Take care. Should now. we stop for a game of Gwent? <laughs> Alright, and these still have uh Axie sign intensity. So I don't know why I'm wearing that. I barely use that. Um I guess that helps when I'm doing the dialogue checks and stuff with people. All right, we'll leave it like that. That had to have proved my armor. We still got to do the boots. I remember I had to do a search to find the diagram for that because we didn't, um, we don't have it. Always Gwent. <laughs> I've played her many times. I got all the good stuff from her. All right, let's dump our old Griffin stuff in here. Pamperan. <laughs> and then later on, we'll have to find where the boots are. Um, oh, yeah, and I wonder is there a set bonus? Uh, there's a lot of bonuses on it. So, what's your gear? Zero of six. Oh, they have to be upgraded to Grandmaster level to unlock bonuses. Oh, the ones below. Okay. All right. Anyway, hopefully that was a good thing to do. We need to move on. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, wrong side. There we go. Yeah, similar sets of bonuses, but lesser. Okay. I won't get that to weigh into the DLC. Be the witch, okay. Pam, Nobody Pam, tell me that my boots don't Pam, match. Pam, they, they're fine. The I didn't. I didn't see a set bonus. Seems like it's per piece, so I think we're okay. All right, let's go back to what we're supposed to be doing. Right there. Or there was two of them, right? Or there. All right, let's go here. Looking good. Have to look good for end game. All right, let's try to move forward. Get this done today. Back here. Supper knives are good for picking your teeth, Charles. Ox. That's a weapon. Picking my teeth with my supper knife. Oh, I remember this one. This one's funny. Not now. Wow. 
watching for Nilfgaard's fleet. Fleet? Oh, aye, they mentioned something. Nay, I've more important matters on my mind. By my calculations, today's the day Givorg, the legendary white whale, will swim the waters of Skellige. Been waiting for this my whole life. Oh. I'll watch for Givorg with you. Let's watch for Givorg together. And you can tell me what you know about any elven ruins in Skellige. Heard of some cavern no one's been able to enter? Good thing, too. Elsewise, they'd have plundered it long ago like all the others. Oh, uh, two. Avon. What? I... Uh, just wanted to assure you I only want to look around the cavern. Oh. It's research. <laughs> research? <laughs> oh, so sad. Um. Writing an adventure novel. Gathering material for it. Mean to write up the coming of the White Fleet? Try, my dear. Mayhaps you could use my translation of the Song of Gilban and Dillion. Gladly, gladly. So where's this cavern? Uh, got a sail east from Kertrolda. Caverns in a cove, only accessible from the sea. So long, and good luck with the white whale. It'll show today. I'm sure of it. Oh. <laughs> it's funny, but it's tragic. He's been waiting his whole life for this. We saw it, and he didn't. Ah, so sad. He'll be back, man. He'll be back. We tried. Those timed ones, man. They are some high pressure. So we don't need to talk to this guy anymore. Well, supposedly we have to go all the way back and talk to Yennefer. Why don't I just go get the sunstone? I don't know. Shooting a rabbit, not me. Alright, where was the signpost? Here it is. Okay, we're supposed to go up here. Um, to here. Ugly as a sea devil. Going somewhere? Siri says there's a site in Skellige we must examine. Avalok's clearly hiding something from us. Earlier, when we were in the Isles together, Avalok mentioned a laboratory. At one point, he wished to teleport there, to retrieve something. And he refused to take me with him. It was all very strange. Sufficiently suspicious, don't you think? Sufficiently. So what? Want to just sneak in and root around? Exactly. Coming with? Fine. Where is it? On a small isle between Undvik and Spikarog. Not exactly on our way. Just found out the sunstone's on Hard Skellig. Cavern along the coast that we can only access from the sea. Gonna need some real magic to get in, too. Go find this laboratory. I'll explore Ard Skellig. You can join me later. Philippa, your eyesight. Only just recovered and magically simulated. Didn't you say you'd need some time to get accustomed? Did I? Magically simulated. Oh, I'd forgotten how irritating she can be. Come, Siri. <laughs> this is our what last uh, important choice. For to get the ending we want. Travel to the island. Why didn't they take me with them? 
All right, I gotta go. No, where am I going? Here. Oh, I can, I can do that. I've been there. Okay. We're gonna pretend that I did my little row row boat. Generally, when I'm doing a full flying playthrough, I try to not fast travel as much as possible. But because we're going back and we're fixing the ending, I'm trying to uh, accelerate a little bit, so I'm not hesitating to fast travel. That's where the key to Yennefer's room went. Um, there's also, I, I refuse to sell it because it's the key to her room. She had the room in Skellige. But um, another thing they changed for the update is it used to be called a common item, which everybody always joked about. Now it's a relic item. <laughs> I'll show you. Um, oh, where is it? Stuff. Yes, key to Yennefer's room is not common anymore, which is good. Okay, we gotta go... Ensemus is very well protected. I believe we'll find something interesting inside. How will you lift the barrier? Atlan Kirk's inclusion should do the trick. Remember. And I also remember what's coming up here. We need. Uh, I believe these are relic. Or no, are they elemental? They're elemental. I remember you teaching me. And. So. Any incriminating letters? Closets full of skeletons? We've not even opened the door yet. It's a highly complex magic barrier. Let's try. Yetta Ligon! We've awoken the sentry. I'll yep. take care of Knew it. First time using my new silver sword. Get him, Siri. Ouch. Looks like we just got one. Where's his loot? Does he have no loot? I guess not. Okay. Pretty cozy. Doesn't look much like a lab at all. That proves nothing. We must look around. It's a bit low, isn't it? Rummaging through his papers. You wish to come, my dear. Yeah, it was your idea. Portrait of Siri, I think. No. Oh, a whole bunch That's of them. That's not me. Where's the scar? It's definitely you. Hmm. Really captured you. Sure, Avalok's only interested in you for your magic abilities. <laughs> Very funny. We don't need that anymore. All right, we're supposed to explore it Look using out. our Witcher senses. It seems someone was literally just here. Avalak's assistant, maybe? No. Somehow, it doesn't seem like Avalak to have one. Distillate? Smells like... Verbena. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha uh -huh what? No, nothing. Sometimes you really get on my nerves, you know. Herbs. 
Not very incriminating. Wait. We've not examined the entire laboratory yet. I didn't quite get that, but except for the fact that they were teasing each other. I think he was just he was just messing. He had no idea what uh, herbs meant. Feel like I've walked into somebody's bedroom. Look at those boots. Yen. It's a family tree. chart of the Enhani Care, the Elder Blood, from Laura Doran. To me? You never showed me the full version. I had no idea Viedmont of Eden was an ancestor. Was he the one who punished his daughters with a hot iron? Or the one who had his own father's eyes gouged out? Him of the daughters. My, even I'd never seen the full version. Seems Avalark has analyzed all the paths of Lara's gene, even those we thought extinct. He's only analyzing? Really believe that? If he's anything like our mages, I seriously doubt he's standing back and observing how Laura's descendants are doing. I don't think we'll ever know if or how deeply the elves have meddled in the gene's mutation. Did you have a hand in... in what Geralt mentioned? The work of those human mages? Of course not. Let's look at his notes. He spent over two centuries on this. He was the first to study Lara's gene. Volker? Hmm. Some entries about Ciri, but it's here, later, that things get interesting. He actually tried to cultivate a genetic mix like Ciri's, but one excluding the human line. Meaning what exactly? That I ought to be looking about for giant jars holding my siblings? <laughs> Don't be foolish. Avalach never got that far. Apparently, all his experiments ended in failure. You are unique. It's funny they and know what genes are. That's why we've a wild hunt to contend with. Let's ferret on. See if we can't find something. Even I guess more they have magic to figure that out. So yeah, we're gonna come across the decision I have to make here, and there may be a timer on it. Uh, so if it when it happens, I will uh, explain it to you afterwards. We're not there yet. But yeah, look at that. That's the family tree. Someone's there beyond the door. Take a picture. Not seen much with my Witcher sensors. Oh, here we go. Hmm. Never a standard. Might have expected a hidden portal. Hmm. I'll sure know their fragrances. All right, those were all crazy things. He may be just a little obsessed, yeah. He plays Gwent. Who is this? How did you get in here? We mean you no harm. I care not at all why you're here. Get out. We 
You. I, I remember you. From Tiernalia. Remarkable. I thought all elves looked alike to those of your race. If it's Avalach you seek, he's not here. I know. And yet you come here. What for? To spy on him. He tries his damnness to save you every time you do something stupid. Is that not enough? What can you possibly know about that? You'd be surprised. He's told me a great deal about you. Like what? He said you shared Lara's features. I don't see whatever it is he sees. It seems a bit like trying to drink water from a mud puddle. Oh my. But are all I elves so snooty? Somehow helps him with his task. What task? Do you think he trails you everywhere for pleasure? Even I grow ill at the sight of you. It's incredible how those like you still believe you're superior to humans, in any way. She's no human. She's a degenerate half-breed. To have no choice but to use something like that? It's humiliating. <laughs> oh my. Another word, and I'll... What? You'll change nothing. She must do what she must. Then Avalach will finally be free of her. I kind of want to stab her. Yeah, I wonder what uh, Yen's threat was going to be. If he hates me so deeply, why didn't he tell me to my face? Siri, you didn't actually believe her, did you? She's uh, personally involved in the matter, that's clear. What of it? She's jealous. If they despise me so, they should leave me be. Siri. What? Do you fear I'll level this place like I did Care Morn? Shame I can't do that at will because I'd really like to now. Uh, go for it. That's the choice. And that's the one I got wrong last time. I told her to calm down, but it's supposed apparently I was supposed to uh, encourage her vandalism. Which how was I supposed to know? Go so slowly, too. Tearing the place up. See, how was I supposed to know that that was the right thing to do? It seems like the wrong thing to do to me, but I guess that's me. I told her to calm down. But all the calm down. But all the choices are about giving her freedom. And trusting her. Yen doesn't like it. But this is all about allowing her to have faith in herself <laughs> later. <laughs> yeah, all the right choices were sort of contrary to what I would have chosen in this, but uh, there, now I know. Up. Now I know. Let's get out of here. Okay, then. <laughs> she did it too. <laughs> she drew the mustache on him. <laughs> She's not above it. Yen's not above it. Cute.
Yeah, go for it for vandalism. Doesn't seem like what a father would say mostly, but I guess we're a different kind of uh, relationship here. Different rules apply to witchers. Must we return to the boat right away? Something else you want to see? Not here. On Hindisfjall. In Lofoten. I met a young man, Skjall. She's just more and subtle like... with her chaos. What is it? Siri. Skjall is dead. The Wild Hunt. Everyone? No one survived? Skjall died later. You're sure it was him? You'd met him? I was there. I saw his body. She didn't mention the part where she reanimated his, his corpse. Me. I'd like to... to say goodbye. I'll go with you. That's actually the last of the Thank choices. You. Could you open a portal to Hindisfjall? I can. Let's do this. Come back soon, all right? Mm -hmm. See you. Yeah, we needed to go with her to the grave. So I think around. that completes all the choices we had to make. Mount. There was five Thank of them. Coming. We had to, to get three out of five. Weeks. I think we got five Especially out of five. Wandering them alone. There was also a choice there whether... So, she's going to live, but there was a choice of whether she's going to end up being a witcher or she's going to end up being the Empress. I chose Witcher, and that was about whether we saw the Emir first back before Bald Mountain or not. Because um, she didn't really want to be Empress, um, but she would have done it out of duty, and she probably would have been good for the country, but uh, I wanted the one where she was going to be the happiest uh, for what she's trained for her whole life. So hopefully we've secured that. Let's see. But there's no way I would have ever figured this out without looking it up. No way. It would have taken so much trial and error. All right, let's look together. Let's look around together. Come on. Lasse, son of Njord. Olaf, son of Ova. Inga, daughter of Chortnir. Damn it. He's not here. Skjall has no grave. Geralt, I shan't leave until I bury him. I think the body... What could have become of it? They didn't burn it. Save that honor for kings and heroes. Doubt they left him in the garden, too. Hmm. Ugh. Bastards. What? Beyond the village. There's a pit. They fill it with sheep taken by Blackleg. Crabs pick at their bones at night. He's looking pretty good for all that time, honestly. <laughs> yeah, Yen did this necromancy on him that killed the whole sacred garden that he was in. Get him to answer questions about Siri. Look at that nice armor I got. There's people back there looking at us. What are you doing? What you should have done long ago. We're burying Skial. Burying Craven? You defy the right of the elders. Be gone. Leave this place. You defile our laws. We're not bound by them. Aye, and you've clearly no respect for our customs either. Craven's place is in the ditch. Skjall saved your bloody lives. The Wild Hunt was after me. Had Skjall not led me away then, why they would have reduced Lofoten to ash? What would the specters be wanting of some lass who- I am not some lass. And anyone who so much as touches this grave will learn that the hard way. Hey, none will disturb it. Desecrating graves 
Well, it's the only thing elders punish harder than fleeing the battlefield. And what you said. Can't know the truth of it. The gods will judge Skjal now. Hit him again. <laughs> they should have hit the ladies too. I am not some lass. She's you were not. right to come. I was deeply troubled. You've no idea. Well, they shouldn't spit on his name anymore. Oh dear, right there. Let's go. Yo. Together. Back to the boat. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Quest completed. We vandalized the laboratory. We visited the grave. We let her go in with the witches alone. The deer wanted to walk with us too. I'm, I'm cool with that. We had a snowball fight with her. And uh, what was the fifth? Anyway, did we did all the right things. Vagrant. All right, so now we got to sneak onto the Emperor's flagship under cover of darkness. So, do we do that from the boat? Boring is fucking shot. Guess not. Where is this now? Where am I? What happened to the sunstone? Oh, here's the sunstone. Let's get that. Yeah. That's a secondary quest now. No. Okay, it's just... They're separate. And they all feed into this main one. All right, let's do the sunstone first. Let's get that done. Man, we're all over the place here. So that is up there. And there is no easy way to get there. Holy crap. There's not even a road. Oh, it's because it said we had to sail there. All right, let's grab a boat. <laughs> I guess that's what we're doing. Vacant. There should be some boats here. Fire! Oh, oops. Uh, okay. <laughs> I had no idea. I don't want to kill you guys. Where's there a boat? Generally it shows when there's a boat, right? I don't have to be closer. I think there'd be one here. You good? You still mad? Oops, yep. Can I grab this boat? There's no fire. What are you talking about? We're just gonna grab one of these and go away. It'll fade once I'm gone for a minute. I just didn't know there'd be a consequence. I could nothing that could be useful in Paris other than this As regards the elder blood. Oh I hear him. I'm saying stuff. <laughs> yeah, we can take this one. All right, let's go. Yeah, 
It's late though, we should meditate. Make it daytime. Can I, uh... Meditate in the boat? Why not, right? They're kind of fragile. But it's fun that there's a mechanic with that. We were sailing all over the place, killing drowned and stuff. All those question marks. They don't show them all now. Because it drove some people crazy. All the completionists thought they had to go to every underwater wreck. Some of these guys. Sirens. Uh, that stench. Oh, get off the boat. I'm gonna try not to be bothered. Gotta get a little bit more. Hear that sirens? He said you're stinky. She did do a little damage to the boat. Okay, it's right here. And there's a boat here. New marker. Ancient crypt. Ooh, you're doing weird stuff. Okay, that's fine. Let's we'll leave it here. You waiting for me, Philippa? Just Philippa. wonderful. I say, look at this. Look at that. Let's go. What now? Gonna grow yourself some new eyes, like Vilgefortz did. I remember the moment I killed him. Cultivation wasn't complete. They hadn't grown in fully yet. Looked disgusting, but... I take it your mention of that deviant is purely coincidental. Of course. Also heard of this rich blind dwarf from Mahakam. Had them put two sizable rubies in his eye sockets. Couldn't see a damn thing. But word is, it looked pretty tasteful. Skeletons. Oop. All right, I think we might need this selected. Right, it's not attacking us yet. Oh, look. What did she just say? around in the carrion. I gotta go to this power stone, lady. Mm, magic. A place of power. Oh, 
these ability points I'm not using. Where is it? Um... Yeah. I'm all full up. Yeah, and they don't do anything, right? Unless you put them over here. Yeah, there's only the red, green, and blue. There's no brown. These are all full. All right. Get up there. the stairs I'll fix them right away I like Philippa your spine is protesting computer chairs I'm gonna switch you to my TV let's go couldn't help all right Jay. The tension between you and Jennifer and Trish. thanks for hanging out glad you'll still Very be there hard on Siri I think Oh yeah, there we're not done. I doubt you three realize how we're just getting to our starting Trist point. Plays a big sister to Siri, but eagerly awaits a chance to hop awesome. in bed with you. Yeah, there'll be lots more. You and more, Jennifer Jay. play the parents. Yeah, so if you're angling to make it a five sum, there's clearly no room. Aw, come on, let her in. Okay, we got somebody up there. Who do we got? Oh, another one of these guys. Uh, let's make sure... It still has a drop on it, but... Um, I never did remember all the uh, colors. It doesn't show on my thing, so... Now it does. Gollum. Good night, Jay. Yeah, so I guess these guys don't have anything to loot. All right, which way are we going? This way? Poor monsters hang out there forever, waiting for us to show up one day. And the whole I thing see, is done in a couple of seconds. What now? It appears I must do everything for you. <laughs> see the sentry who seems to be waiting for payment. I'm fresh out of change. Oh, no, you're not. In blood, not coin. The sentry is Fearlin of the Elven legend. Do you literally read nothing? He's actually supposed to be pretty well educated. Ooh, do you have to cut it that hard? Oh, just a little cut. That's what you need. There you are. Yennefer must have tremendous pull with the Emperor. To get him to guarantee the Lodge's safety. What's your take on it? My take? Obviously a leading question. No. Geralt, I'm tired. Let's sit and chat a bit first. Is foreplay that important to you? <laughs> you ought to talk to Yennefer. Painfully clear there's unfinished business there. Yennefer's always walked her own path. I'm actually touched she decided to take an interest in matters of the Lodge this time. You don't trust her. So once the hunt's defeated, leave. Find asylum elsewhere. 
I hear a Dania's offering. I'd sooner stick my head in a Zoogle's spiky orifice. Yikes. Thanks, but I've other plans. You'll get to work with the Emperor. Not excited? No. I, I mean, yes, of course I am. Thus far, the Lodge has oft banked on weak rulers. It's been one of our biggest mistakes. Hmm. So you're impressed Amir keeps his mages on a short leash? Yennefer's wise to keep you out of politics. I'm afraid you'd not realize which way the wind was blowing if you pissed straight into it. <laughs> I like her. This deal with Amir. It's sorceress business. Pick someone else's brain. So she's not told you anything? What about personal plans? Has she mentioned anything? A possible advisory position? Beside a young, promising empress? Stay away from Ciri. She's an adult, Geralt. You keep forgetting. She can decide for herself. So, onward. Don't you think it's time you stopped interfering in Ciri's life? No. But you do know we're not a pack of wolves you can just drive away from her with your sword. Sure you are. And yes, I can, if the need arises. Yeah, I wouldn't want to tangle with uh, a bunch of sorceresses. But it doesn't have to be like that. Wait. There's something here. Feel it? No. My medallion... A ridiculous bauble. It made me laugh. Tuning into elven magic is just slightly more difficult than sniffing out a malodorous fiend. Watch this. Arahan Luma! means the sunstone is here. Don't stand there looking stupid. Try to shift the mirrors. Try to shift the mirrors. <laughs> Alright, what are we trying to do? So the light's coming from there. Or are we shifting it to there? Now let's find out. Okay. Uh oh. The ghost. Not a very tough ghost. Uh -huh. What did that do? Alright, it's still... Getting light from there, but it's only going there. Now, now they're going to two places. So that only has those two positions. Now it won't let me do it. Come on. Yeah, so it's that or that. I feel like that's the proper one. But I have no idea. I mean, do we just need to go shift all of them one at a time, or what? Can we get up to this one? There's things in my way. Uh, Shift it to torch for you all. No. Nope. 
the torch now? Now it is. All right, have fun. I'll see you later. Bye bye, Pookie. I'm glad you liked it. Have a good night. So that just shifts it to that. Is there a fourth mirror? So the light is definitely coming from that, going to there. Much better ankles. Ooh, I like the ladies singing. Definitely gonna have a ghost here, right? Ghosty? No? Hmm. Alright, well, let's just shift them all once, I guess. Let's see what that does. Change this other one again. No. No. Excellent. Just sitting up here. At last. Hand it over and let's get out of here. Not so fast. We have a matter to discuss. Let me guess. You gotta fly. You're about to tell me why you need the Sunstone so much more than we do. Then you'll change into an owl and whoosh. No idea where you got such a ridiculous notion. Ciri's safety is most important to me now. But I wish to talk to you about the future. My future. <laughs> I recommend the Alpine Air of Nazaire. <laughs> Uh, I guess two is more to the point. I wouldn't worry. Emperor's got plans for you, I'm sure. Stop playing the jester and listen to me. Oh, that was a joke, too. Once we've defeated the hunt and Ciri is safe, Yennefer's meteoric rise at the Imperial Court will come to an abrupt end, which is wonderful from my perspective. I'm not interested in reviving the Lodge if I'm not to have the deciding vote. You're telling me this because... If I know even one bit, I expect that once we've defeated the Wild Hunt, you aim to slip out the back door with Ciri. To disappear into the wilds, correct? All very romantic. But perhaps instead of destroying the girl's life, you could take Yennefer with you and go. You want to take Yen's place at Amir's side. And at Ciri's. I think you understand it's inevitable. And I would truly prefer Yennefer to be far away when it happens. 
Holding her in the Imperial dungeon would be costly. And it would give the wrong impression. Any other words of wisdom, or can we go? You may go. I know you've things to do. You think she'd be a little afraid to turn into the owl right now, <laughs> considering she was stuck that way. All right, let's go. Uh, where does this go? Ghost do drop dude, look at that. I'm assuming it gave me a way out of the level, or is this getting myself into more trouble? Probably should have just gone back the way I came in. Probably, huh? Let's just look a little further. In case there's some goodies here. Like my diagram for my boots. I don't know why they make all this if it didn't have something. going up on oh, this is a whole nother way oh my god I like that silver This is a dead end, good. Treasure! Treasure! Lots of yummy treasure! Taking me. Where are we on the map right now? I wonder if we can see where we are. Oh, look at that. This is taking us all the way back. Very nice. Okay. Come on. They all have the same thing. And this looks like the way out. But what's up here? <laughs> oh, we can't. We're not allowed. Okay. 
That's fine. Okay. And that took us all the way to here. Let's go there. Maybe there's a signpost I haven't discovered. Man, look how good it looks. I recognize your type a mile away. Okay. Oh, there's a signpost. Maybe Lars will bring some hair hides back well, from the hunt. My I bet I can do some good Gwent here. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright, we gotta sneak on to the Emperor's ship under cover of darkness. So we gotta go over here. Alright, let's go. It's clearing up. All right, let's do a little save. And I guess we'll make it nighttime. Mm, not late enough yet. So we just gotta like swim, I guess, and dive when we get close enough. Let's go over here. Oh, you know what? I bet we have a potion for this. Just get out of the line of sight. we got it's got to be a way to sort search vitality so many things we could be using um I want One for breathing underwater. Interesting to know we have that when we need it. Increases our inventory weight. Maybe we don't. I would have assumed we'd have something for breathing underwater. Uh, but apparently we don't. Okay. Whatever. I assume we gotta avoid those lights. Emperor ship is which one? Way out there.
I don't know. Can we surface here? Well, we don't need to yet. Let's get a breath. I think we just have to not surface on the lights. I would assume. Somewhere in here. All right, let's get a breath. It's the Witcher! Emperor's orders! Stand down! Okay. So we know where to go, it's over here. Can I get up on the anchor? Can you go up? Yes. I got a wet a letter for you. Surprise. Mailman. Warm welcome. Thank you, your majesty. You should have come with my daughter. Your welcome would have been different. Where is she? Here we go. Nearby. Close. Close, White Wolf, is what you are to decapitation. You're insolent because you believe I cannot afford to hurt you. And you're right. Yet that will change one day, when you are no longer indispensable, but disposable. But enough of that. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. What do you want? Fringilla Vigo. And told you promised Yennefer you'd free her. I can see. I know you're a busy man. So here's a letter. Ought to refresh your memory about the lodge. Even Yennefer's humblest requests seem like threats. I've always liked that about her. Very well, so be it. Truly prepared to forgive them? Amnesty in exchange for help? I'm prepared to abide by the agreement I made with Yennefer. Didn't answer my question. Nor must I. <laughs> okay. Time I was on my way. At last, a point we agree on. Guards, bring me Fringilla Vigo. You may remove her dimeritium shackles. Dimeritium. He talks like an emperor. No introductions are necessary from what I've heard. Farewell. Prince He's not going to zap him in the back? Been a while. The other sorceresses, they're on Ginvale near Ard Skellig. We could take a boat. I'm sick to death of boats. Spies teleports, but have it your way. Let's go. Easy enough. Frinchilla. Triss. Where's Yennefer? She'll be here soon, and she's sure to want to talk to you. I don't doubt it. <sighs> all right, Avalok, it's all good to go. Yes, Geralt.
Margarita any better? I managed to accelerate tissue regeneration. She's feeling much better. In fact, we must bring Eridin here as soon as possible. Otherwise, I'm afraid these sorceresses... Of this Fringilla is so much hotter? Cells. What, did they change it? Once we use the Sunstone, what makes you think Eridan won't figure things out? I doubt he'll think the Elves of the White Fleet suddenly long to see him. We can alter the signal emitted by the Sunstone. Unlikely Eridan will recognize its origin. It's not the only artifact to possess this power. There are others? Great. Now mind telling me why I had to scour Skellige looking for this one? The Sunstone was the easiest to find, believe me. Weird how it uh, fades in and out like that. Uh... Tell me something more about Caranthir. Know him well? Know him? I On the TV him. show. Raised, don't you mean? Yeah. No, Geralt. I began shaping him long before he was born. For centuries, I brought together pairs of elves manifesting certain abilities, those able to manipulate time and space. He is the result of these efforts. Breeding program. Caranthia, a golden child. He's a eugenicist. Golden child who grew up to be a criminal. Mm -hmm. You imprisoned Siri the first time you met her. Now you protect her while fighting against your own kind. Quite an about face. First of all, I did not imprison her. She found me. It was her destiny. Yeah, sure. Get to the second of all. Why are you helping her? Because she is a danger. A mortal one. You look at her and see a human. A ward. A daughter, even. I look and see the Elder Blood. A power that can destroy the world. A power that must be kept from Eridin's power-addled hands at all costs. Admittedly, our motives differ. Yet in spite of that, we share a goal. So you would be wise to trust me. Or at least try. From the look of things, pretty soon Siri won't need your help anymore. Nor yours. True. She'll do whatever she wants, and I'll support her. What about you? Ready to let her live her own life? I shan't force her to do anything, if that's your question. I've been avoiding this one, but uh, it's there. Let's do it. Went by your laboratory. Went by your laboratory? I trust you did not make a mess. Didn't mention you were the NL Elves' chief source of knowledge about Ciri's abilities. I didn't mention many things. Fortunately, they're no longer important. Your experiments with the gene, Elder Blood, that's not important. I pursued those studies to protect Ciri. To protect Lara Doran's blood in whomever's veins it courses. Okay. Uh, let's just go with, I believe you. I believe you. I know. You'd never let me within 500 yards of Siri otherwise. All right, let's, uh, let's go. We found the Sunstone. Gail Barnes' gift to Dillion of the White Fleet. As legend has it, she never used the stone, and Gelban died of sorrow. Won't keep Eridan waiting that long. It seems we've everything. We can go. Keep in mind, once we commit, there'll be no returning. <coughs> okay. I'm ready when he is. I am going to go visit the little monkey's room one more time, in case there's no pause after this. I'll be right back.
Alrighty. Let's do this. I'm ready. High time we set sail. Undvik awaits. In that case, let's go. Let's go. None of that I'll meet you on the Unvik stuff. Nice shot. Okay, we made it to endgame. Indeed. You will position yourselves on the cliffs. Here, here, and... Thank you. I believe we know how to form a circle. Even those of us who lack eyes for the moment. I simply wish to avoid... Oh, Geralt. We were waiting for you. That's nice of you. <coughs> You're also snide. You were about to explain your plan. It's simple. Which Margarita does looks not much mean better. It will be easy to execute. I shall activate the sunstone. If Caranthia answers the call, the Nagel Fair should appear in the bay shortly afterwards. The lodge must then prevent the ship from returning to the world of the NL, while the Imperial fleet blocks its escape by sea. The Seventh Imlet's infantry regiment under Duke Varatra must then board it, with your help, naturally. What about you? Where will you be? Waiting in reserve. If something goes wrong, I shall react. Hmm. Like a general commanding troops from a hilltop? Gonna signal us by horn or use messengers? Exquisite irony, but what did I do to deserve it? Have I given you cause to doubt my intentions? Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, it's not really time for that kind action, of. Uh, please. Sisters, we must scale the cliff. Scathing stuff. It's time to bond. Good luck. Yeah, that was a negative note, Geralt. <laughs> Plan's missing one important element. What about Siri? Cyril will wait, at a safe distance from the Nagel Fair. Wild guess. Not what you had in mind. No, I wanted to go with you. That was my idea. But I won't allow it. Far too great a risk. Don't have the right to order her around. Amusing. Zirel said the same thing, only at much higher volume. <laughs> I do, in fact, have this right. For only I know how to activate the Sunstone, which I shall do on my terms oh, or not at all. that's his card. Tyrell recognized the strength of my argument. I have no doubt you will do the same. Tyrell. Can we get a little do bit more warm and fuzzy in here, guys? Do I have a choice? <laughs> okay, group hug. Where are you going? For a walk. Or is that not allowed either? Because I could break my leg. Oh, yes. The elder blood can be fiery. Telling Siri she can't do something is counterproductive, speaking from experience there. Ultimately, she does what she wants. Let us hope. Pardon me? Never mind. Time is short. If you wish to do something, brew your substances or whatnot, do it now. You won't get the chance later. I shall await you by the boats amongst the soldiers. Okay. Now, in the first playthrough, I had a very hard time with this fight. I seem to be doing better now. Um. Oh, Yin. Time Yen, for the warm fuzzies. Why are you here? To see you. Something happened? Not yet, but it might soon. We may not survive this. In fact, our chances are slim. Well, we are here to battle Eridan and the Wild Hunt at full strength. Could be like Sodden. Could be worse. Nothing could be worse than Sodden was. Listen to me. Once it's over, if we survive, I wish to leave. Go far away. 
and I'd like you to come with me. Yeah. Where? Wherever. To Povis, beyond the Dragon Mountains, Zeracania even. As far as possible from politics, plots, and so-called high society. go anywhere with you. The answer, right answer I was hoping for. Go, Geralt. Avalaka waits. Good answer. Got a spooch. And don't get killed, Witcher. I'll do my best. Okay. And that was the uh, other ending we were looking for. We got that one before. Triss would never do this. What? Go away somewhere? Heard of the Vryhead Brigade? Or, I mean, she's here for this fight. Hey, there's a signpost here. We could go off and do all kinds of other things for a while. And this would still be here for us. So, Geralt. Ready? We can start. Let's get these bastards. With pleasure, Geralt. With pleasure. Quest failed. Reason of state. What? I have to take a look at that. You mean every, leave everything to live in the end? I might have to go back. I have to see what that is. I give you my heart. Oh, we never killed Radovic, did we? What kind of spell is that? It's an old love letter. Ancient. As I said, this stone was to reunite a pair of lovers. Never thought I'd say anything of the sort to Eredin. And Verilith. The Radovid mission. Oh, Ada crap. Ech, Blaine, Ida May. We gotta go back. All right. Uh, hopefully, this is the one right before. Ten thirty. What time is it? It's ten thirty-one. Let's go back to that. I definitely want to kill Radovid. I thought that that would come up somehow. Nope, it's the one before that. <clears throat> okay, um... Reason of state. Uh, yeah. All right, let's go check that out real quick. If this takes too long, I might not be able to finish tonight. We might start with the final fight at the beginning of the next episode. Um, but let's go see about this. Because that's important. I was joking about the signpost. Mm -hmm. I guess I'm not. It's over here. Where is it? Uh, Where'd it go? It's right over there. Pam, Pam, 
Mm. Here it is. Can we be done in 30 minutes? <laughs> All right. Let's go see. Yeah, I can't leave that one alone. He's like he's killing people. Sometimes it's a handful. He's got to go. What am I doing wrong? On me, Dan Ben. They told me. All right, we're not, get, we're not getting involved. <laughs> Stunted bricks, all this shit. Here? Does you let the beast in there? Who's there? Witcher Geralt. Get in here. Boss awaits up. Bloody tell us what this is about. Just as soon as Geralt arrives. Should he arrive? If you want a fairy talk, at least you can do well, it. We can loot around. stuff. Witcher, at last. Now, we're all present. And up the fucking creek. Why have you summoned us? Radovid's on his ship. We'll not get to him there, I told you. Stop it. I have an idea how to draw him onto dry land. But all in due course. Let's start by confessing our sins. I let Philippa Eilhart in on our plan. Mea culpa. Bravo. Bloody bravo. Now, now. It's not a disaster. The Lady Sorceress is highly unlikely to warn the brat. What's more, she's willing to help us kill him. Naturally, it's nothing I'll ever agree to. But Phil, she's inspired me. Call her my muse. Inspired you to do what? Patience. We've yet to get to the substance of the matter. Geralt, do I recall correctly that Radovid's hired you to find Philippa? Only thing I've found is her hideout. What's your point? We can use Philippa without involving her, provided you help. Radovid expects you to report to him, bring him information about her. All you need to do is mention her name, intimate that you've a lead, you're on her trail. Oh, he'll swallow that. Hook, line, sinker, and a good bit of the rod as well. Let's say Radovid bites, believes me, and none of that's a given. What then? You'll tell him you've found Philippa's hideout, somewhere where we can easily set a trap and ambush. Suggestions? Bridge to Temple Isle, built up both sides, lots of nooks, gates, easy to block off from the rest of the city. Good idea. I'll divide my men, post half on one end, other half on the other, by the gate, and in the middle, this with a well-oiled crossbow. You see, Geralt, all we ask is that you invite Radovid out for a stroll, bring him to the bridge. We'll take care of the rest. So what'll it be? I'm in. I'm in. But once it's done, what then? There'll be an uproar in the city. Panic, maybe. Need a place where we can wait it out. Thought of that already. Remember Madame Arena's theater? Abandoned now, not a soul looks in there. Tala and I will await you there. Await us? Unwilling to risk your own necks? Not the point. Deeksra and I have many cocksucking virtues, but fighting ability is just not one of them. Not as fit for that as we are for a bleeding beauty pageant. Don't worry, Geralt. My people are battle-hardened. They'll manage. You just bring them the kill. Do what I can. Where's his ship moored these days? Just round the corner, in Novograd's port. 
And for your sake, I hope he's in a good mood when you look in on him. Oh, well, there she is. The bridge must be clear. My lads will make sure of that. Guards round the temple, what about them? Won't they bloody congregate when they see the fighting? All right. They pay the tidy sum, they won't. Let's move on. Philippa, what the hell are you doing here? Geralt, don't ask questions you know the answers to. It makes you look stupid. <laughs> I like her. Eavesdropping on your conversation, naturally. With a good deal of interest. And a measure of wonder. Mind telling me what you found puzzling? Your naivety. Do you honestly believe Radovid will fall for such a crude ruse? Radovid's lost his mind. Doesn't think rationally anymore. That's why. That is why he may very well choose to torture you, even if you brought me to him in chains. Just because. Philippa, uh, why even tell me this? Concerned about me that much? Not at all. It's because I think it vital that Radovid die. You don't want my help, more's the pity. But I shall do what I can to make certain you don't fuck it up. Here, take this. A ring. Redanian eagle etched in the ruby. It belonged to Vizimir, Radovid's father. Hand him that, and he may believe you captured me. He might even choose to trust you. Helpful. Thanks. Don't mention it. Believe me, I'm prepared to do much more to be rid of Radovid. Good luck, Geralt. You'll need it. Zoom. You think she would have met me a little further away? All right. Oh my God, that's a lot of soldiers. Out of my oh. way. I'm not gonna take the bait of that little oh bitty quest right there. Whatever it is, might be a cool one. Seems you But we got stuff to do. How far am I going? Uh, okay. Yeah, it's no point in fast traveling. Ooh. Lure him from his ship. We could swim over there. <laughs> Apparently another thing they've changed is that the uh, soldiers used to be as hard as the worst boss. Now they're just like any other regular mob. So you can murderize soldiers much more easily. We can go at it here or at my place. Oh my. One wonderful. Fires like to go out for I get them papers. My old ship hasn't my poor timer. It hasn't and never will. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Let's do a little savey save right there. Every sinner will burn in it. Witcher Geralt, what do you want? They nerf them. Audience. Got new information about Philippa Eilhart. Let you mess around a lot more, I guess. I'll need your weapons. Now follow me. Your Majesty. The Witcher. My very the nice fancy Philippa weapons. Eilhart. I hope you brought something better than magic crystals this time. I know where she is. Perhaps. Or perhaps you seek to trick me. Like the others. What others? Uh, you see, a rumor went around that I'd generously reward any who bring information about Isleheart. There's no shortage of the greedy and the stupid. So a queue quickly formed at the gangway to the ship. The first aboard was a hunter. 
brought me a dead owl with no eyes. He thought I'd believe it, shower him with gold. I had him blinded, then thrown overboard with a stone tied round his neck. The second was the postmaster from Oxenfurt, claimed to have a letter she'd penned. It was forged, of course. I had his fingers cut off. He'll never write again. Oh, and I took his tongue. The spoken lie is just as reprehensible. Needless to say, the rest of the queue dispersed quickly. I'm a professional. Got a reputation to uphold. Be stupid of me to come to you empty-handed. My father's ring. Philippa used it to stamp her decrees, then distribute them as the word of the king. Where is she? Under your nose, sire. In Novigrad, in a house on the bridge leading to Temple Isle. Why haven't you brought her to me? Gotta capture someone to take them anywhere. All I did was track her down, then stole this ring as proof that I had. Do you fear her? No. You want to kill her yourself. With your own hands. I know this. You shall come with me. Hubrecht, gather the men. How many, sire? All of them. I was going to say, all of them. I didn't know that, but must have been. Nice building. Very cool well, mosaic. Where is she? Where is Philippa? Like I said, house on the bridge, closer to the other end. Close off this end. We need no guests, no innocent bystanders, or witnesses. Damian, Duke, Egbert, Freak, Kaspar. You shall stay here, secure the rear, and kill the Witcher. Which one? This is how you thank who serve you, or you don't know where she is? Uh, let's do two. You don't know where Philip is hiding. Not exactly without me. Fret not. We'll manage. Naturally, it would be easier with your help, but you irritate me. You know too much. You impede me too often. And I find your arrogance an annoyance. I've had men killed for less. Follow me. Any last words? Oh, fuck! Free the Witcher, then run of it. Ah! Uh, I better get my swords back. You'll never know. Oh, how'd they get that up? Okay, Thanks grab my help. swords. Plan's gone nice. to hell. So be it. We'll improvise. Follow me, Geralt. We must get to Radovid before reinforcements arrive. Let's go. Ever fight a Witcher? These guys are chumps. This guy. I don't like the wish hunters. Let's 
just do one of these, why not? These guys are good at parrying. They don't blow over easy. Stop parrying me! There we go. All these guts and loot I'm leaving behind. There he is all by himself. This is it, buddy. Open up! I command you to open the door. Burn him at the stake. Oh needed many to ask. I'm gonna blind him. That settles the score. She didn't and waste. That was from the heart. She didn't waste a lot of time, did she? Forgive me. I wanted to see her lick I it. I could not deny myself the pleasure. How did she? Where? Why? How the fuck? Eavesdropped on us, back at the warehouse. What? And you didn't think it worth mentioning? No. Lads, the time to discuss this is later. Hmm? Radovid is dead. It matters not by whose hand. Mission accomplished. Now let's get the hell away. Place will be thick with Redanians in minutes. Let's go. Vernon's always got that rag on his head. Only 22 experience. Well, what? Is it done? It's done. Though all did not go according to plan. More on that later. First a stiff drink and a toast. The North. Tamaria. 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 Bloody Tamaria. <laughs> Bloody Tamaria. Tamaria. Ah. What now, Roach? A new guerrilla campaign against the Black Ones? No. The war just ended. How's that? There's something I don't know about? I'd say so. You see, tomorrow at noon, the commander of Army Group Center will sign a truce in Amir's name. A truce whose wording we agreed with Dijkstra. So back there in Velen, when the trolls nabbed you? Yes, I was returning from the last round of talks. Amir will keep Edion and Lyria, but in exchange for Radovich Ed and a stop to guerrilla activities, he will withdraw from Tamaria. Which will become the Empire's vassal state. Self-ruled internally, with its own courts, administrative structures and armies. The silver lilies will bloom neath the rays of the great sun. So I say were I a poet. But I'm not. So all I'll say is there was no so other I won't say that. way. <laughs> uh, I want the whole truth. Haven't told me the whole truth. You're right on that account. We know you're bloody allergic to politics, decided to emphasize majors and whatnot. 
If it were done when tis done, then twere well it were done quickly. That but this blow might be the be-all and end-all here. What's that? Vakmeth, Act 1, Vak Scene Vakmeth. <laughs> Always wanted to play that. Never cast as anything but a halberdier. Geralt, what Tala told you, put it out of your mind. There will be no truce with Nilfgaard. Redania, under my enlightened rule, will fight on until it wins. And when it does, it will unite all the North, including Temeria. What? Ow! This is not what we plow and agreed. True. Instead, we insisted on one realm's questionable sovereignty. And to recover it, we gave Amir virtually all the North's other kingdoms. It was not a wise arrangement. So, no deal. You two-faced horse. I will not allow this. Actually, you, Roach, should be the first to understand I've no choice. Why the hell would I understand? Because you too are a patriot. Geralt, this doesn't concern you. You may go. <clears throat> Fare thee well on your path, or what not. We'll let you kill them. Can't let you kill them, Dijkstra. Oh, hard luck. Then you'll die with them. Kill them all. All right, we're fighting again. We can't kill him. He's casting hexes. What do you think is gonna happen? Can I get up here? Guys are chumps. Oh, now we get to get him. Kill the Sorry, Dijkstra. Get him, Vez. Too late to surrender. Too late. Bloody hell! Bugger me sideways! That was close. Very close. It's hardly over. The envoy, due to meet the Nilf Guardians tomorrow. No doubt Dijkstra ordered him killed. We'll need to protect him. Sorry, you're on your own, I... You've had your fill of politics, I understand. Once it's over, come to Vizima. You'll be received with honors. Farewell, Wolf. All right, we handled that. That was all the right choice. Evil soft first touches. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, so we got to go talk to Avalok. I think, guys, this we're about to hit eight hours. I think we're just going to start with the ending at the beginning next time. Oh, let's grab all this goodies. Yeah, that was the only main fight, and I, I don't want to rush it. Well, I'm out here now. I guess I can't get all those goodies. Can I? Yeah, I can. I don't want to rush it. I want to savor it. Sir Garwin, where you been? Hello. How are you? Uh, I think, yeah, we'll start the... And this is at the end of an eight-hour episode, so... I don't know how many people will actually get to this part. <laughs> so... Oh, we've got one. We will start fresh on, what's today? It's Tuesday. I'm actually going to be gone for the weekend. Mm. So we may have to wait till, um, 
I'll be back Saturday, so we'll have to wait till Saturday to do it. Right on. Thank you. Oh, what am I doing? I'm doing the wrong thing. Got to go to... Did I not select it? Is it? It's not Novagrab, is it? No. Oh, I didn't select it properly. There we go. That's what we got to do. Yeah, and we'll start out with that. We'll savor uh, the work we've done to get this ending right. And now yeah, that's a nice little cliffhanger to end on, I think. And then, yeah, then we can take our time and I don't have to rush. Uh, I don't have to rush through the end game. Uh, plus, I'm tired. So this way, uh, we'll make sure that I'm nice and fresh for the end fight. Oh, you were watching and lurk? Awesome, man. I'm glad you were here. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll just have to talk to Avalach. Uh, we'll get a nice save right here. So, get a nice new one. And, yeah. So, yeah, thank you all, you guys. Let's make it daytime. For hanging out with me for this one. And joining me in our return to The Witcher 3. And it's new, very pretty, and upgraded form. Indeed. So, yeah, I appreciate all of you for joining. Keeping me company for this. Um, it's been quite fun. I'm really glad that uh, I'm revisiting this. And, yeah, we're going to get this... Uh, we'll start the next episode with... The ending, and uh, pretty dang sure we got it right this time, and uh, did do a little research on that, so hopefully we're good, and then we'll start with a happy ending, <laughs> and then we'll proceed forthwith unto the DLC and get those going, and probably keep this going until we can get those done. We'll see how long they take, but I know that um, they are quite meaty and uh, quite worth doing. So yeah, uh, thank you CD Projekt Red for all the content. And yeah, thank you all for hanging out with me. So I'm gonna be out of town on Thursday, but I'll be back on Saturday. So we'll schedule it then. Um, hopefully, I'll be back uh, not too late. If not, we'll do it on Sunday. But uh, I'll tentatively schedule it for Saturday and we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I hope you all are there then, and uh, all the folks who hung out with me live, and all the folks who watch this later. Um, I will see you then. Um, yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh my goodness. Things are getting crazy over here. But until then, guys, thank you very much for watching until the end of this stream, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye. <laughs> the Emperor shall guide us straight to Novigrad. <laughs> <laughs>